Sister Tina, do you take Michael as a lovely wedded husband to love and to cherish in sickness and in health, for better, for worse, till death do you part? Yes, I do. <laughs> Brother Michael, do you take Tina as a lovely wedded wife to love and to cherish in sickness and in health, for better, for worse, to death do you pass? Yes, I do. What others join together, no man can tell. What's written is written. Now you may kiss the bride. And no one can resist. Finally we are one and no one can divide that's the will of God No more asunder no more heartbreak together forever No more sad party no more bad Rich, hey. wow, how do you sleep like this now? Hey. After five, Tina, Tina, you bros, bros, wake up, wake up, wake up. You need to pay me. Tina, how do you sleep like this before? Huh? How come, how come, bros, you know they hear me. Wake up, wake up, pay me my money. Time don't go, I need to they go. I, I, by now, I'm supposed to not reach house, bros. Oh, yeah, yeah, do, 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 answer me, answer me. They waste my time. Hey, Tina, 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 you shot past like this before now. Nah. Which one? This one we can't do now. Nah. Eh? People can't see you for wood. In here, people don't wake up since now. Nah. Sure? 
Oh, Ross, man, you know they hear me. Wake up. We can't sleep in the sleep. Oh. How, how much? Boss, why they ask me this kind of question now? Uh uh. Me and you talk and say overnight and 20,000 naira. But, bros, if you add something put, you don't go bad now. If, so that you don't go do like those other ones. You'll be correct. You'll be correct, bros. Hey, where my shoe even there now? Bros, I bet quick, make you settle with the money. See that you don't do like, where are my clothes? Where are my shoe? Where are my everything? Where are my Imagine things when I wake up suddenly. And the only thing you could imagine is how prostitutes demand their pay in the morning after servicing their clients, obviously. Tina, so this is who you are. with an insurance company, right? Yes, Mike. I work with Mandela Insurance. That's where you met me. Yes, because you combined that work with prostitution. That's what. Mm. You are nothing but a despicable prostitute. Mm. Jesus Christ, how the hell did I get here? I beg you in the name Don't come close to me, I swear to God. I will, I, will, I will kill you with my hands. Let me explain. Don't come close to me, I swear to you. I would, I would, I would slough your life. Out of you. Let me explain why. What is your story? <laughs> Please, you know what me. is your freaking story? Like, let me explain myself. Like, I love you all my heart. When I, when I, when I came to Abuja. Right. I didn't have anywhere to uh -huh. stay. <laughs> my auntie that promised me disappointed me. Exactly. That's when. That's when of all the options in the world you chose to pick on prostitution. Uh, no. Of all the options in the world. You are nothing but a filthy Abuja oh, Ron's girl. That is what you are. You should be ashamed of yourself. You should be ashamed of your existence. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't you dare touch me. I swear to God. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare touch me. Don't touch me. Ever. I beg, I love you. Please. Don't say that to me. Say that to me one more time. Say that to me one more time. What I'll do to you. What I will do to you, you say that to me again, I swear to God, I will kill you. I came into your life thinking that I was dealing with a human being. I opened my heart, I opened my world to you. I led you to my world, I told you everything about me. Jesus Christ! And what did you do? What did you do, you bitch? You decided to show me a packaged you. That is what you did. I fell for it. Hook, line and sink, I got married to you. Only for me to wake up to this. I curse the day that I met you. If I ever see you again, don't see me. I will kill you. You want money, right? Do you want money? You want money, right? You want money? You want money? You want money, right? You want money? 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 You want You Idiot! <laughs> this is over. You want money, right? <laughs> Life is like a stage where Karnak's house are displayed many times before. It does not mean we fail. We all have our flaws. When Roy Nekam, man is full of imperfection. We all have our flaws. Where are you, come on? Man is full of imperfection.
Listen, man, my plan is to get married to Tina right away. What? Are you I'm serious. Crazy? I'm serious. <laughs> no, you can't be serious. You just got to know this girl about Montego and you're talking about getting married. What? Well, no, come on, man. I met her in Abuja in February when I traveled for that AGM, I told you. Look, I know we lost contact, but she never left my mind. And so? Nice to meet you again. <laughs> uh, come on, man. Uh, Mike, come on, this is ridiculous. You don't even know anything about her. What are you talking about? I don't need a lifetime to know her. I spent one month with her. Blissful. A blissful one month. I'm happy, man. Uh. So, how long have you been around? Um, for about a month. Oh, mm -hmm. that's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Have you been sightseeing? Oh, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. seen some nice places. Oh. <laughs> you know how it is. Mm -hmm. well, that's good to know. <laughs> Kenny. And I can tell that she's my missing rib. I have been searching for so long. And God just put her in the palm of my hands. And you think that I can let go. But it's not possible. Mike, Tina is a gorgeous lady. I think you're infatuated. No, I'm not infatuated. I'm in love with her. I wonder what they're discussing, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Men, I'm sure it's soccer. Or making money, how to make more money. For real. I'm serious, man. I know what I feel for this girl. You know, my plan right, right now is just to, you know, pay her bride price and just take her straight to the altar. Mike, <laughs> I think you just have to take your time over this. What are you talking about? Take what time? What's the point in moving when you've gotten into your destination? Tina is my destination, man. We're here. Why are we having this conversation? We should be planning a wedding, man. Eh? Mike, are you sure of this? The feeling is real, man. My next move will be to just pay her bride price and take her straight to the altar. Hmm. This is serious. Very serious. Does she know your plans? Well, I have engaged her, so I'd like to think that she knows where I'm going with this. You're really sure of this? I'm certain. Very certain. It's okay if that makes you happy. Then, it's okay. Thank you. Thank you, man. Uh, thanks. You know what? Uh, let's get back to you, ladies. Uh, let's not stay away from them for too long. Come on. Let's go. Sipping on what? Juice, I'm okay. Yes. <laughs> and <so>. oh. yeah. <laughs> I heard you. <laughs> I heard you. Sure. Uh, we can change it with our juice. Yeah. Right. Sure. So, both of you are probably acquainted now. Mm -hmm. So when I'm busy, you have someone to, to you know, hit the town with. Sure. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Amaka is a jolly good fellow, so it's safe. <laughs> well, you're just keeping quiet, rubbing on your woman and, and stuff. Yeah, that's what I should you? be doing. <laughs> Taking care of my woman and stuff. <laughs> mm. Come on, keep your leg here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, hey, babe! Hey, boo! You going out? Yes, I am. No, 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 no. It's a lie. It's the truth. I, I, 
I, I, I, I don't understand. Like, how did you even do it? I just a month ago and all of this is happening. <laughs> I know, right? You know, he said he couldn't wait anymore. Mm. He just wanted me to be his wife. I'm low-key jealous. Oh, please. I, I, I feel bad. <laughs> oh, come low key. on. Low-key. I'm so happy for you, babes. I'm so happy as well. Thank you. My goodness. All these years, mm -hmm. we've been here with this guy. He didn't notice all of us. <laughs> you came from Abuja in one month. Voila. <laughs> Marriage. <laughs> I Indeed, know, right? the ways of God is really different from that of man. Hmm, Babes, what did you even again. do? I need the secret. <laughs> you can say that again. Nothing. I did nothing. I know, right? It's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Come, where are you going to? Hunger won't keep person. I want to go get food. <laughs> Babe, I needed to eat. You are not going anywhere. I have just for you. Not to worry. I bought us pizza. Made. Of you course, know. it's a standard. I have to be your cheap bridesmaid or no one else. Let's go in. I, have I know, I can't wait. I need to tell you exactly how it all happened. I'm dying to hear all the details. <laughs> I know. Yes. You want to hear all of it? I'm so, I'm so curious. Oh. <sighs> 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 it looks so good. I know, your favorites. Indeed. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Babe, mm -hmm. this tastes heavenly. <laughs> I trust mm. you. You are food. Story of my life. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Babe, huh? he's going to see my people next week. <clears throat> next week? Mm -hmm. And immediately after the bride prize, the wedding follows. <laughs> Come on, mm. Tina. Don't you think this is moving a bit too fast? Huh. My dear, I can't stop it. Too. Mike is all over me. He loves me too much to care about how long we've met. Same way you love him. Don't make it look like it's one-sided. <laughs> I don't just love him. I care about him. I can attest to that. I mean, you've practically been living in cloud nine since you came across him. My dear, not just cloud nine, cloud ten. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this guy is so loving. He's so nice. Hmm. So romantic. Aww. And he's committed to our relationship. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's so sweet, you know, but... Tina. Hmm? Have you actually checked him out? How? A guy like Mike is likely to have baggages. How? Mike is handsome, sociable, romantic. He's most likely to have baby mamas here and there. <laughs> have you tried finding out about that? My dear, trust me, I thought about it. And? And I just casually asked him and he said nothing like that. And I believe him. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> and, babe, mm -hmm. we've gone foul. Yes, we have done a series of tests and we are fine. He's AA and I'm also AA. Her genotype are a perfect match. Mm. What more do I want? <laughs> Babes. Hmm? This is one incredible love story, you know. I mean, like the type we see in movies. It is my own love story. Indeed. <laughs> oh. And you know what? Tell me. He said he's been searching, but now he's finally found his last bus stop. Hmm. See, not the last bus stop. Money. Ah, I am the last bus stop. Good. I am the last bus stop. <laughs> You better start getting prepared because you are my maid of honor. Of course. Mm -hmm. It's a standard. I have to be your maid of honor. Uh, if not, who else? I trust you. Mm. <laughs> Proudly. <laughs> Meanwhile, we have a wedding to plan. Yes, we do. <laughs> yes, we and do. all the colors are going to be up to me. Mm -hmm. Leave that with me, okay? I trust you, but you can carry on with your love story. It is not your wedding. Oh, please, don't remind me. <laughs> It's our wedding. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> mm. Seriously.
Seriously, I'm so happy for you, babes. I am. I'm happy for myself as well. Mm. Can you walk him? Be cool, mama. Can you walk him? I did. <laughs> what's good? So what's up? Good. With updates. Good. You got the hall, eh? Um, I've gone to secure the hall. Oh, okay, cool. And I've um. What? What do you want to hear? Oh no no! You, you, you said know, you what said you... do you want to hear? What I didn't say anything. And what do you want to hear? Well, you said you secured okay, the hall. I've, I've paid for the hall too. <laughs> Get out, <laughs> Kenny. I'm serious. Come on, man. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. It's Come okay. on, that's expensive, man. You can go ahead and um, settle with the cooling. Of course, I'll take that. But it's, isn't that putting a hole in your pocket? It, it, it's it's a lot. My guy, now. Thank you. Okay. I really appreciate. It. For the cooling vibe, we, we I got in touch with um, with um, a cooling van um, facility. Yes, um, because I changed my mind. I, I think we're gonna have a lot of guests, so I might as well um, not use a small van. You know, something really really big. Okay. So I walked into the facility and guess who I saw? An old schoolmate. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so I told him I'm getting married. He was quite excited. Congratulated me okay. and told me that um, I can come tomorrow pick. Which of the vans that I want and then make payment. So we're good. Sure. That should be better. Yeah. You know, I'm so happy that everything is falling into place real fast. I'm happy. You know what they say, huh? The world is ready for a man who knows where he's headed. That's eh? right. That's right. I am happy. <laughs> <laughs> so how is Tina? Fine, man. We spoke, um, I think, about 45 minutes ago. She's also in town running around putting a few things together from her own end. And mm -hmm. then she was just telling me what she's going through with her bridal train. That's what mm -hmm. they call it, right? Yeah. Bridal yeah. train and the person bringing the cake and all of that. You know, uh, women and their thing. <laughs> well, their issues. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, I, I, I envy you, man. I envy you. In a week's time, my friend Mike Miko that I know is going to be a married man. You, you should be married too soon. You can do it when you're ready because I know my Amaka is ready. Uh, yeah, but Amaka is just pulling me back. What are you saying? That girl loves you, man. Eh? That girl loves you. With all... Have you seen her around you? Mike, I know she loves me, but... You know, she digs into my past. She digs into everything, trying to make everything hard for me. That makes me feel that she doesn't really love me enough. No, she loves you. Maybe she just loves you so much that she wants to know everything about you. Every little detail. Some women are like that. You know, relax bro. She wants to know everything about your life, past, present and even future. You're plenty of scapes with women. Mike, are you Sabi? Are you Sabi? <laughs> Hold on to that girl, man. She's a good woman, man. Trust me. Eh? Well, thank you so much for today, man. So, what's that? We are looking good. This is how far I have gone. Okay. Um, this is how much um, I have um, ticked off the list of um, things that we we'll have to do. Um, Mike, before this, I'm very thirsty. I need to drink something. You want to drink? Am I supposed to ask? <laughs> <laughs> you know I got you. You know, you know what you I know I, I got you. Are you, are, you are, you're waiting you for me to ask you first before you give me something to drink. I'm enjoying this. Mr. Tina, do you take Michael as your lovely wedded husband to love and to cherish in sickness and in health, for better, for worse, till then do you part? Yes, I do. <laughs> Brother Michael, do you take Tina as your lovely wedded wife to love and to cherish in sickness and in health, for better, for worse, to death do your part. Yes, I do. What God has joined together, no man can tell. What's written is written.
Now you may kiss the bride. I've been calling you. That's why you didn't pick my call because don't they pick us in salon? Eh hey, now, you were disturbing. You kept on calling and calling. I didn't pick, you didn't rest. You were just calling and calling and you were disturbing everybody that was there. So Shut I... up! Bloody liar! I was disturbing. Who, who was I disturbing? I see, I, I'm not lying. Just stop this subject. I'm not lying. That's how you keep on monitoring me everywhere I go. I go to the bedroom, you monitor me. I go to the toilet, you monitor me. Market Unko, you monitor me. What was what, all this now? Eh? You keep on monitoring me as if I'm your house help. See, Joseph. In case you've forgotten, I am not your house I am your wife. Oh. So you know you're my wife, Sandra. You know you're my wife. But you go out there, cheat on me. I'm lying to my face. I don't know what you're talking about. You said, I don't know what you're talking about. Let me just be honest with you. I'm not happy at all. I'm not happy. I'm not happy. You prevented me from attending my uncle's wedding today. Uncle Mike's wedding. And now you won't allow me to have rest. What's all this now? Which, which Uncle Mike are you talking about? The, the same Uncle Mike, the same man that said, I am nothing, that I'm not good for you, that I'm a foolish boy. Oh yeah, go to the wedding, I want to see you with my eyes. Enter the wedding now. Sandra, as your husband, your legally married husband, I am ordering you. Oh yeah, enter the house now. I am not going anywhere. I'm seeing this thing clear. So your plan is to go back to Tony's house. You want to go back to your ex, Abby? What's the meaning of all this now? Hey, hey, Joseph, I am not coming from anybody's house and I am not following you in there. I will sleep here like all the mosquitoes eat me. It's my body. Do this will happen now. If you don't follow me to this house, eh, I will kill you here and I will kill myself. Two of us will enter heaven and, and settle this matter now. Sandra, oh yeah, enter this house. Bella, you should better start saying now. Joseph, what are you doing? Joseph! Sandra, Sandra, you want to beat me a bit? Enter this house. Joseph.
do rich. Hey. Wow, how do you sleep like this now? Hey! After five. Tina! Tina, you... Bros, bros, wake up, wake up, wake up. You need to pay me. Tina, how do you sleep like this before, man? How come, how come? Bros, you know they hear me. Wake up, wake up. Pay me my money. Time don't go, I need to go. Ah, by now, I'm supposed to reach house. Bros! Oh, yeah, yeah, do, 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 do. Answer me, answer me. They waste my time. Hey! Tina, Tina, Tina. You shall pass like this before now. Nah. Which one be this one we can't do now? Nah. Eh? People come to see you for wood. In here. So we don't wake up since now. Nah. Sure? Oh. Bros, man, you know they hear me. Wake up. Which can sleep in the sleep? Oh. How, how much? Bros, why they ask me this kind of question now? Nah? Uh-uh. Me and you talk and say overnight and 20,000 naira. But bros, if you add something put, you no go bad now. Nah. So that like, you no go do like those other ones. You be correct. You be correct, bros. Hey, where my shoe even there now? Bros, I better quick make you settle me the money. See that you know they do like, where are my clothes? Where my shoe? Where my everything? Where my Imagine things when I wake up suddenly. And the only thing you could imagine is how prostitutes demand their pay in the morning after servicing their clients, obviously. Tina, so this is who you are. With an insurance company, right? Yes, Mike. I work with Mandela Insurance. That's the way you met me. Yes, because you combined that work with prostitution. That's what? Mm. You are nothing but a despicable prostitute. Mm. Mm. Jesus Christ, how the hell did I get here? I beg you in the name Don't come close to me, I swear to God. I would kill you with my hands. Let me explain. Don't come close to me, I swear to God. I would, I would slough your Mike. life. Out of you. Let me explain myself. What is your story? Please, now what is your freaking story? Let me explain myself. Like, I love you, don't mind. When I when I when I came to Abuja, right? I didn't have anywhere to uh -huh. stay. <laughs> My auntie that promised me disappointed me. Exactly. That's when. That's when of all the options in the world you chose. Become prostitution. Oh, no. Of all the options in the world, you are nothing but a filthy Abuja oh, Rose girl. Baby. That is what you are. You should be ashamed of yourself. You should be ashamed of your existence. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't, touch me. Don't you dare touch me. I swear to God. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare touch me. Don't touch me. Ever. I love you. Please. Don't say that to me. Don't say that to me one more time. Say that to me one more time, what I'll do to you. What I will do to you. You say that to me again, I swear to God, I'll kill you. I came into your life thinking that I was dealing with a human being. I opened my heart, I opened my world to you. I led you to my world. I told you everything about me. Jesus Christ! And what did you do? What did you do, you bitch? You decided to show me a package view. That is what you did. I fell for it. Who cried and sink? I got married to you only for me to wake up to this. I curse the day that I met you. If I ever see you again, trust in me. I will kill you. You want money, right? Please. Do you want money? 
want money, right? You want money. You want money. You want money, right? You want money. 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 You You want money. 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 You You want money. You want money. You want You want money. 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 Life on stage where Karnak's house are displayed Many times before It does not mean we fail We all have the flaws When ruin it can be Man is full of imperfection We all have the flaws When ruin it can be Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life Who is, is that person now? Take it easy. What you think of. Who? God is not a man. Okay? God is not easy. a man. Take it easy. He knows more than you do. Okay? Just call me. Uh, but, okay, you just finish with that with your wife for now. Hey. Ha. Nah, eh? Life is like a stage <laughs> where <laughs> cars are displayed <laughs> many times before. <laughs> Does not mean we okay. 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 Yeah. have flaws. <laughs> We all have our flaws. Where on your come, man is full of imperfection. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. In the morning, early in the Honeymoon, baby. I thought you would be sleeping all day due to last night. <coughs> Gozi, where are you? Me? Of course I'm in the house. Why? Are you sobbing? Why are you sobbing? I'm not okay. I'm not okay. My world has collapsed right before me. Tina, what is the problem? Where's, where's your husband? Ngozi, please. Just pack my traveling bag and bring it to the hotel. Pack anything you can find of me. Just, just come as soon as possible, please. Tina, you are scaring me. What is it? Give me an idea. What is wrong? Why are you crying like this? If you don't come now, you might not meet me alive. No, 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 no. Don't say that. Please come. Right away. <laughs> I'll be right. Life is like a stage where currents are displayed. Many times before, <laughs> does not mean we failed. We are out of our flaws. When ruin it comes, man, man is full of imperfection. <laughs> Perfection. Life is deeper than what you think. 
what have I done to deserve this kind of punishment and humiliation? <sighs> what have I done? Everybody warned me. They warned me. They told me to get to know her, but I did not listen. I was carried away by the beauty and finesse of an ordinary prostitute. I did not know that she was the devil's incarnate. How do I ever begin to explain <laughs> to my friends and associates? from far and wide that the marriage is off. There is a big problem now. There is a big problem. My ogre shot himself. I'm not drunk. I'm not drunk. I'm not drunk. He came back alone. The next thing I heard is, why? Ogre shot himself with the gun. And I believe that Ogre has died. I'm not mad, yo. I'm not mad. You need to come and see it by yourself. Yo. You need to come. Yo. Hello? 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 Said he came back alone. Yes. Then 
I still I hear this Moab. Oga shot himself for, and I believe Oga is dead. Oga my Ukwala. Oga my Ukwala. Clement. <laughs> Michael, my brother is dead. Yes. No. Devil, you are a liar. <laughs> Oga is a liar. You principalities and powers from the coven of demons. I am going to cripple you today. You cannot. My brother will not. Michael, what happened? Michael! Michael, what is it? What happened? What are you doing with a gun? Michael, where is your wife? Get up or not? Have you finished your honeymoon? Because, oh, talk to me. Karun, your only sister. Tell me, get if you may talk to me, please. Oh, man. Because, oh. Because, Michael, please say something. Huh? That. Only brother Mado. It will not go well with them. Satan, you are a liar. They will gather, but they will scatter in seven folds. You cannot penetrate my brother. Not when I am still alive. You demon from anywhere you're coming from. I cripple you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. God of Abraham, God of Elijah, God of Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego. This will not happen. It is not a generational cause. My grandfather married. My father married. My brother will marry. Wherever this is coming from, I am crippling you. I am crippling you in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. You cannot do this. Hey, you King Adonai, King of Kings. Hey, Jehovah, Jehovah Nesse, Jehovah Shama. Oh, village people, village people. So this is what her plan is. God, will I wake up from this dream? My whole world just dissolved right before my eyes. God with the wind. Calm down. Calm down, please. You know, I just can't believe this. Tina, I still think you would have taken out time and explained to him that you used to be a Ron's girl. Given how crazy Mike was about you, he still would have married you. Especially if he truly loves you. Oh, we both know he don't. Why didn't you? Gozi, it was just for a short while. I got to Abuja, things were hard for me. I just had to survive. But I stopped immediately, I got a job. It was very short when it was. <laughs> this is bad luck. <sighs> this is just bad luck. That's what I can make of it. <sighs> but Tina, what I still can't process is how you could open your mouth and see such rubbish of all this. 
<laughs> Tina, what were you thinking? Oh, see, I don't know. I don't know. It had to be my wedding night of all night. I can't perform it. I think I'm paying for all my sins. <laughs> <laughs> Tina, don't talk like that. I know you're hurt, but we'll definitely find a way out of this. Okay? No, there's no way. There is just no way out. No. There is. Listen, Tina. Mike will come back. Right now, he's just so shocked and upset, which is a given. Any man in a shoe right now would act exactly the way he... I don't think you understand what I'm saying. You, you needed to see the looks in his eyes. He was full with hatred and disgust. Jose, he actually called me a, a dirty pig. <laughs> Listen, those are the words people use when they are very upset. After which they will calm down and still come around. And so would Mike. Okay? I'm sure the whole world would know by now. Everybody will reject me. They will abandon me. Don't talk like that. I was want to die. <laughs> Let me just oh talk God. all the time. <laughs> Tina, Tina, the world would not abandon you. I am right here with you. I'm still your friend. <laughs> we all have our flaws. When Ronnie comes, man is full of imperfection. We all have our flaws. When Ronnie comes. I see you like to drink. Huh? Oh, beautiful. You like good things. So <laughs> As I was saying, my brother, mm. see, all this I love you, I love you uh, talk before marriage is fancy talk. When a man is ripe for marriage, he gets married. Simple. When you accept a woman as your wife, then you begin to love her. That's the way it works. Yes. Really? Yes. I did not know my wife before I married her. It was my aunt, my mother's sister, mm. that recommended her. Mm. And I saw her and married her. Today, we are living happily ever after. Three wonderful children. Two big boys and a girl. Adana, you know her? Yeah. My, my, my daughter. Yes, I do. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It was actually my mother that reincarnated in her. Oh, okay. Yes, that is why we have this uh, special bond. Uh, so, I closed the chapter of childbearing since. And uh, you are here still talking about uh, choosing a wife. I love her, sick I love her. I said, I love her, but I'm telling you. No, my God. No, my God. Okay. I thank God for your life. Uh, but I will not um, do that. I think it's a bit um, ancient and crude, your methods. Times have changed, and things are done differently now. Which times have changed? As far as family is concerned, nothing has changed. Nothing. Yes, you know I have traveled around the world. Yes. <laughs> you know I have been to places in this my life. Mm. And I can tell you that a woman is a woman from Australia to Timbuktu. Mm. And so, forget about all this uh, picking women like beans. Now I pick, why can they pick beans? Just pick a wife, get married, have children, and settle down. Simple. That is a man. Well, you know what they say, that you see what you see from where you stand. This is how you see life. That is not how I see life. So I'm sorry to say that I disagree with your methods. I, I will not do that, I'm sorry. You disagree with me? Yes, I disagree. Sorry. It's okay. You can disagree with me. 
but you will not disagree that uh, time waits for no one. Oh, that is relative. Oh, uh, well. Uh, okay, relative, okay. Uh, but I will advise you to bring your eyes down. Mm. Mike, bring your eyes down. Mm. If possible, go to the village and pick a good girl from a good family. Yes, at least if there is a problem, you know who to report to. Why would you advise me to go to the... It's the 21st century. Go to the village to pick. In the 21st century, they don't ma ma marry from the village. Malika, please. I do not intend to have a marriage. You would have to report the circumstances in my marriage to a third party, even if they are family. I will not do that. If my wife and I cannot resolve the issues that we're having in our marriage, then what's the point? It's not worth it. Anyway, that is for you. Me, I report to... I report. Last month, just last month, my wife misbehaved. And I reported her to her, to, to her father. Yes, and they called her to order. And today, we are we're, we're now living happily ever after again. So that is the way it is. That's the way it is. Um, but if you feel uh, differently because of this, your Yibo life, no problem. But thank you for the wine. Uh, I'll be going. I can see you like the drink. Mm -hmm. Like it, as usual. Mm. It is fine. Mm. So, let me go. My... Go and see my wife. Uh, yes, <laughs> go and see your wife. <laughs> hey. so, thank you. Uh, thank you. Mm. So, when you call us, we'll answer you. You see, you can know. to do me a favor or gently. Of course. Anything for you. Here. I need you to withdraw some money for me. I need to sort out myself. Please. I need about 150,000. I can't go out there. I'm too ashamed. I don't understand. I mean, why do I need to go withdraw some money? What about all this money I packed? No, no, no. I don't want to have anything to do with this money. Cosy, please. Please. So what will happen to this money? If you say so. I'm playing to you. Ngozi. Yes. Thank you for being there for me. Of course. What are friends for? Now I need you to promise me one thing. That you're not going to do something stupid. Please, Tina, you really have to promise me. I won't. That's my girl. I have another request. 
Yes, I do. Come on, I'm not asking for too much. And you have to say yes, even before I mention my request. Okay, yes. That when I leave here, you will go into the bath and take a shower. Water has a way of making people feel better. You've been depressed all day. I need you to freshen up and just rest your head. And I'll be back in no time. Sure. All right? Okay. Um, because the pain. Oh! <laughs> I practically forgot to ask. Two, two okay. five, five, four. Two, Current. Two, five, five, four. Okay. I'll be right back. Okay. In the shower, please. You can understand why I don't want to use this one. If it's me, I'll use it. We all have our flaws. Oh, we're all yet a man. Man is full of imperfection. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man, God is not a man, he knows. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I, 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 I overreacted, I'm sorry I shouted at you. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know how to take what you what you said to me, so I just got upset, you know. But hey, I'm here now. Because I miss you. I can't live without you, baby. Huh? I'm sorry. I've come to take you home with me. Will you come with me? Never leave my life. I've been calling you since and you haven't been picking my calls. Okay, no problem. But please, come as early as possible. Never leave my life. Michael, I always told you to do strong prayers. Do dry fastings, but you don't do them. That is why the devil invaded your life. I kept telling you to come down to the village and get a decent wife from a decent home. I had one ready. But what do you do? You keep flying from one country to the other, from one state to the other. Have you seen the result? Have you seen it? Holy heaven. Sister, I don't know why you are like this. We have talked about this several times. And you know, my business does not allow me the room to travel to the village as often as you would have preferred. But it will give you a chance to go to places where you will meet where what girls are useless ones that just disgraced you. Eh? Ifulia? You are so lucky she's only a prostitute, not a ghost. A Michael receives sense. Receive wisdom. Read the Bible. Study the word of God. I've heard you now, sister. I've heard you. Stop rubbing it in. It's fine. I hear you. Why won't I rub it in? Michael, tell me. Why won't I rub it in? Hi. Heavens. King of kings. 
God of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, please make my brother see. Michael, don't you know that the madman's relations are more ashamed of his condition than himself? That's what you're saying. No, 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 no. Look, you just called me a madman. I did not. But check it. Guy work. I'm done with this. It's enough. I've had just enough. This is the problem. You don't listen. That's just the problem. My only concern is that you are our only son. It's not. Michael, I will leave you to your foolishness. What is this? Hey! Holy Moses, God of Abraham, God of Isaac, Jacob, Abadinego, give my brother wisdom. You made Solomon a wisdom man. You gave Solomon wisdom, Father. You made David the man after your heart. Why won't you give my brother wisdom? Let my brother receive wisdom. You village people, anywhere you have gathered, you will never succeed. I know you will gather, but in seven forms you will scatter. Holy Moses! My girl, you must marry. You must marry. I must hear the cry of a baby in this house. Hello? Uh, madam, the money for this room has expired and you've passed your checkout time. Oh, I'm sorry. Can you please just exercise some patience? My friend went out with my ATM card. Um, Mom, we have POS here and you can actually do transfer. I know, but my friend went with my card so I have to wait for her to get back. And I don't have mobile banking app on my phone. Please, just give me some time. Ma, it's against our company policy. We don't do that. But I respect you because you just got married. I understand. Thank you very much. All right. Well. This is more than wonders. I mean, the guy practically abandoned her in that hotel and vanished. Just like that. Oh, poor girl. But this were all in her past. Who told you it's in her past? It's in her blood. Once a prostitute, always a prostitute. No. Tina surely changed. What are you saying? She did not change. Even the short while she was living here with us, I noticed all the traces of a prostitute in her, even though she was trying to hide it. Because I do not believe this. Because I never saw any sign of prostitution in her character. So what are you saying? Really? How would you see it? How would you see it when all you do is Mother Theresa, Mother Righteousness? I mean, the whole thing was just too good to be true. <sighs> you know, I kept wondering how this girl came from Abuja all of a sudden. Fiam, marriage. Fiam, everything was just happening so fast. If the whole thing was too good to be true. Okay, think about it. If she was genuinely good, if she was really as good as she was pretending to be, 
Why didn't she find a husband in Abuja? Hmm? Hmm. Gazi, I just do not feel good about this whole thing, honestly. I can imagine what she's just going through right now. Hmm. Me oh. too. Poor okay. girl. I feel bad for her. Which reminds me of what my pastor always says. Whatever you sow, that you shall reap. I mean, you can't be a prostitute in Abuja hustling all the men and all of a sudden you want to come to Lagos and play the wife material. How does that even happen? I don't know what to say again because I'm just tired. Just... Anyway, what is my own self? Oh, I just wish she gets through with all these problems. It's too much for her. Could imagine what she's just passing through right now. Well, me too. I just wish people would start making good decisions so that they don't keep falling into this kind of tragedy. <sighs> but I'm sure she'll be fine. Well, me too. Anyway, babes, I'm hungry. I need to go get something to eat. Okay. Mm -hmm. So much for an abandoned bride on her wedding day. Going on. I'm fine. You promised to come since morning and I've been waiting for you. Tina, let me just tell you the truth. I don't want to be associated with you anymore. Hmm? Yes. Tina, I don't want people to think of me as a prostitute. I have a serious fiance and I don't want stories. Because what are you talking about? Do I have water in my mouth? Tina, don't call my number again. Your news is all over town and I don't want to be smeared by it. Ngozi, why do you choose to bite me when I'm down? The question is, why do you want to drag me in your mess? Don't you have a sister or a relation? Call them and leave me alone. Okay. No problem. Good. What about my money? What money? I gave you my ATM card to help me get some cash. Please, where is the money? Where is it? The hotel people are already on my neck to pay up. Tina, please, that is none of my business. <laughs> Do you think, didn't you hear me? I don't care. You can send someone to come take your ATM. Just don't call my number again. Rubbish. Nonsense. Can you imagine? Can you? What's she calling me? Am I the only one she knows? Nonsense. Was I, when she was prostituting with all the men in Abuja, was I there? Now she's calling me. I beg you. Not a man, 
God is not a man. If you don't know Tina, she's a very selfish person. Can you imagine? I accommodated Tina in this house for free. I did made of honor for her for free. I even went as far as going to the hotel to see her when everyone else was running away from her. Now she wants to turn me to an errand girl. What nonsense! For you promised to help her, didn't you? I did. So, if you see, I hate anyone taking me for granted. I hate it! That I promised to be there for her doesn't mean I was going to become her slave. Uh-uh. Whatever what is what doing is what's doing well. You should have helped her with the money because of her present situation. If you don't understand. See, I'm not a bad person, no. Really? I'm a very good person. I've been good to people and it has not worked for me. Now I've decided to be like other people. Really? Yes. Besides, I told her she can send someone to come and pick up her ATM card. That's fair enough. Okay, can you give me the ATM so I'll go take it to her? She could be stranded, you know. <laughs> Wait. What kind of sympathy club are you trying to form? No, 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 no. What are you trying to prove? So all this while I've been talking, I've just been blabbing. You want to take the ATM card to her so that you'll be the good person and God will now become the bad one. Because nobody's calling you a bad person. I'm only trying to help a friend here. Nobody's calling you a bad person. Ah, Mother Teresa. Rubbish. Help her of all. Have you explained me that, Simon? Where is my phone, Seth? Let me go and change and see a big girl, babe, when it's Are you actually walking out on me? No, 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 no. I am lying down on your behalf, Mother Teresa. Rubbish. The whole thing is too shocking for me to take. I became a bachelor. My wedding night. How do you explain that, Ken? Do you know? I was proudly showing my sisters the wedding pictures, and they, they were all gushing over them. Uh, where is she at the moment? I don't know. I don't care. So, what are we going to do? Nothing. It's over again. It's over. like this. How can Ngozi of all people tell lies about me just to drag traffic on her Facebook page? Mm. What, what of your husband? Mm. 
He's there. He's just surviving by his grace. Don't worry. Miracle will happen. Sure. Miracle will happen. I, uh, and he will get up again. <laughs> mm. Amen. I believe so. Amen to God. Carol, mm. <laughs> uh, uh, do you know why I came? Uh, I heard that uh, that Obanje girl, the one your brother married before, uh, 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 she has finally gone to Dubai. Dubai? Dubai, where these girls do all kinds of dirty things to make money. Even I didn't chance share that. In Dubai? Because of money, yes. Hello, my parents. Very dirty, dirty things they do with all those Arab men. I knew it! I knew she's a Delilah. Hmm! That is where she should belong, not even in my brother's house. Exactly. Exactly. What did they say? This kind of thing is what they say. Uh, 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 good, you how do they put it? Um, uh, good riddance to bad, to bad rubbish. Hey! Our brother is lucky. She would have finished his life. He even killed him with her witchcraft. Jezebel. Je correct, Jezebel. That is. Not your bubble. Jezebel. Hey! Father, I give you I all the glory. I know where I might. There is nobody like you because you are the ascent of days. Amen. Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Lord. Thank you, King of Kings. Amen. Thank Lord. you, Lord of Hope. Bam. Amen. Amen. Do you know that I was even supposed to travel to the village for our kindred meeting mm. this weekend, this past weekend? Mm -hmm. But I suspended it because I was ashamed. I was ashamed. You know, all these village gossips who begin to ask you, eh, eh, what happened? Eh, the, my, the wife might get married. Eh, what did the people say happened? So I just avoided anything concerning village. Because of that girl. Madokawane, I feel so ashamed. But what can I do? Hmm. Michael is my only brother. It's a Me too fear to fear. Ban, ban. Hmm? You cannot. You cannot. You are on the right track. Uh, they say you have to chase away the kite first yes. before you ask the chick why he strayed <laughs> away like that. Ah, I took away. Away, do I walk because you are You are very correct, Madoka. You are full of wisdom. <laughs> well, <It's yeah>. so <laughs> it is God, though. It's by God's grace. Uh, You're right. Mm. God gave Solomon wisdom. Unlike Michael, my brother, he has refused to put his eyes down. Hmm? To receive sense and wisdom. Michael, I'm a Ranyan, a Lenin, and Carlon. We're still a young man. It's not like us. A lot of young men are in Christ. I go to church every day. I, I see them. Correct. You're correct. Don't worry, he will be fine. Uh, um, uh, every iron must pass through fire. <laughs> you are mm. right. You are right. Yeah, yeah. My yeah. dear, I was getting ready for Bible study oh. before you came in. Oh, my God, no, I said, I should see you. You know, I am now the new secretary of women for Christ League in the church. Wonderful. I am telling you. Wonderful. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, good, good, good things are coming to our place. <laughs> <laughs> there is nothing like walking in the Lord's vineyard. Yeah. Nothing it like it. It gives me joy. Wonderful. <laughs> well done, my dear. My dear. Well done. Uh, no problem. Yes. I, I, I can even drop you in the church. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, okay. I will drop you. Get you. It's our church. <laughs> Get my bag. Yes, I have only one bag for church. <laughs> exactly. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Won't you finish your drink? Nah, I'm okay. Let me get you in here. Not upset, guy. But, God in there. All right. Yeah. Okay. Make sure you lock the door. I'm always okay. happy to be here. Mm, because which which are there? You know, when I go to. Hey, they are calling already. Yeah, they are calling already. Yes. Yeah. Hello, I 
Put that money in my hand. Go, I want it. You don't sleep me alone, though. No. Just sleep me alone. No. I'm not giving you any money. You let me kill me. I'm not giving you any money. Where was the last time you gave me money for my upkeep? Eh? Are you, yeah. are you mad? What is upkeep? Eh? What are you keeping up for? You are my wife. And whatever I want. So, 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 because I'm now married to you, I should, I should be looking like a tout, eh? So, because I'm now married to you, I should look like a slave. I should look like those women that, that sell, sell tomatoes in the market. Joseph, I'm not giving you any money. Put that money. If you want a slave, you should go to the village. Put and that get money a... in my hand. I don't care. Put that money in my hand. Joseph, I'm not giving you any money. Put that money in my hand. So, you want to turn me into a slave simply because I'm married to you? Give me my money. Joseph. Listen, listen, listen. I will break your neck. I'm not playing with you. I'm not playing with you. I'm not giving you any money. I'm not giving you. I'm not giving. I'm not playing with you. Wow! Look at you, NG. You're looking so good. Thank you. <laughs> nice to see you again after this difficult period. I know. Huh? Your friend is so unlucky, you know. I will never understand why good men always fall into the hands of bad girls. My dear, things happen. Everything about that marriage happened too fast. I was even worried about your friend, not knowing Tina would turn out to be the devil. <laughs> that was really a mess. Exactly. Bam, she just came down from Abuja. Boom, she met Mike. Next thing, marriage. I was like, sure. Do you know, she even confessed to me that she has been a Ron's girl right from her school days. Yes! She even said that the thing has gotten into her blood and she couldn't afford to stop it, whether single or married. Wait. Can you imagine? She said that? Hmm. She said even worse things. I mean, rotten things I can't afford to utter. Oh, that is really bad. My friend is so devastated. Oh, poor him. You have to console him. I mean, you, he needs you. You would have to console him and also advise him to take things more slowly next time. I think you're right. I'll do that. And not fall for pretense. Because if he was patient, he would have seen right through the mm -hmm. fact that that girl... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll do just that. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> nice to see you. Lizzie. Thank you. <laughs> By the way, where are you up to? Um, I just want to go check some property down the street. Oh, really? Yeah. I'll come with you. It's the weekend and I'm free. Come on. All right. <laughs> Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man. God is not a man. He knows more than you do. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man. God is not a man. He knows more than you do. God is not a man. God is not a man. He knows more than you do. When you think you stand, be careful lest you fall, cause the world is full of temptation and frustration. Be careful who you condemn, my candy, my Richie, you might be the next in line. Be careful who you condemn, my candy, my Richie, you might be the next in line. Hello, love. Hello, baby. Just checking up on you today. Ah, that's so nice. Well, I'm at home. <laughs> Is there anyone around you looking for a trouble? Just tell me. I'll come and deal with them. Nobody dares. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You remember our deal today? Sure, baby. I've told you to relax. I'll be there. I've given you my word already. Okay. See you then. Thanks, love. I'll see you. Mm? You've made my day. It's okay. You take care, huh? All right, baby. 
Bye. <laughs>actually passing and I decided to stop by and say hello. Wow, that's very nice of you. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm actually going to see my tailor. I'm preparing for my cousin's traditional wedding. Your cousin? Yes. She's getting married to a guy who was best man in a wedding in which she was made of honor just two months ago. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's nice. Uh, just like we were at uh, Mike's wedding. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. I've seen that a couple of times, you know. Uh, the best man wears made of honor. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, my cousin Ijoma is so lucky, you know. Mm. Initially, she said she didn't like the guy. All of a sudden, she became head over heels for him. Wow. wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It happens. It happens. Sometimes you might like someone and all of a sudden... The whole thing might just turn around. I know. Yeah. yeah. yeah okay. It appears you're going out. Oh, no, no. I'm just um, waiting for my fiance. Your fiance? Yeah, my fiance. I never knew you had one. Oh. Well, I, I better take my leave. I wouldn't want to spoil things for you. Okay, that's, that's okay. Uh, very nice of you checking on me. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey. What is she doing here? Uh, oh, she um, she was just passing by and decided to say hello. The fact that you both did best man and maid of honor doesn't mean you are now husband and wife. <laughs> Babe, that, come on, that's so funny. I don't find it funny. And this won't be the first time you're seen together recently. Have you ever seen us together before? I don't have to see you personally, but people. Someone saw you cruising around town together. And the way she just looked at me now says it all. Says what all? That we are rivals. <sighs> Babe, come on, come on. Are you not tired of all this? Huh? Are you not? I just want to be sure you are ready to settle down. Uh, but you are the one delaying us. Because you're not ready yet. How? Your hands are full with girls. Which girls are you talking about? Like the one I just met. <sighs> Sweetheart, please. Can we just stop this? Come on, let's go inside. Come on, let's stop this, please. Come on. Kennedy never told me he had a fiancé. Well, you guys had nothing going on, or did you? But I gave him all the signal. I thought he had some feelings for me. Babe, it doesn't work that way. <sighs> what about Obina? I thought you guys had something serious. How can I have something serious to do with a poor man? That guy is very young and very promising. What are you saying? Please, 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 please. I am not interested in any promises or promising. If a wayward girl like Tina could get a big boy like Mike, oh, why should I settle with a promising poor man? Poor Bina is not even that poor. At least he has a car and... If he please, please, please. I'm not in the mood. I am so not in the mood for this sermon. Huh? What nonsense.
nonsense car he's driving with no AC safe. It's where you want me to go and be. I beg no person, sorry. <sighs> What I expected of Kennedy. This is not what I expected. How can he have a I'm the one delaying our marriage. Yes, of course. But you said you were going to see my people some time ago. And then you changed your mind. Why? I thought we've discussed this before. That was the week after Mike wedded and had problems with the wife. And so? The atmosphere wasn't conducive for such a trip. Mike is my best friend. I hate what Mike did to Tina. He just made a mountain out of a molehill. I guess you both are beds of the same feathers. And what's the meaning of all this? Did you just come here to get upset or what? Lest I forget. You said you were traveling to Abuja last weekend, huh? Of course I did. No, you did not. You were right here in town. I can tell you every bit of your movement and activities. Come on, Amaka, come on. Are you monitoring my movement or what? What's the meaning of all this? I aren't you tired of quarreling? The meaning is that. I am not ready to be toyed with by any unserious man anymore. I've heard how you treat girls, how you use and dump them. But I decided to give you the benefits of doubt. You just confound my feelings. Amaka, what's this? This is ridiculous. Come on. Amaka, you know I love you. Yes. And I've dropped plans for our wedding. And how we're going to live our life together. You know I love you. Really? Sorry to bust your bubble. You can keep that plan for someone else. You ought to know I'm too serious minded for such childish game. I'm out. Uh, uh, I'm Life is like a stage where characters are displayed many times before. Does Damn. not mean we failed. We all have our flaws. Man is full of imperfection We all have our flaws Man is full of imperfection Amaka, you know I hate seeing you in this mood You told me Kennedy was the man you even told me how wonderful he is. Now what happened? He cheated on you? Talk to me, Amaka. Huh? Mom. I thought this was the end of the search. But Kennedy turned out to be like others. A cheat. And a liar. God, God, why? God, why do you give me cheats and liars? What have I done, God? God, why? It's okay, my dear. It's okay. I wish you listened to me. I wish you could be more patient with your suitors. Mom, are you suggesting that I am the problem? I should settle for cheats and liars. Is that what you're saying, mother? I did not say that. What I'm saying is that no one is perfect. Everyone has got some skeleton in their cupboard. But the idea of digging the, into the past and the present of your suitors is not the best. So, I shouldn't know anything about the man? Is that what you're saying, mom? Knowing anything and knowing everything is not the same thing. Mom, 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 no, I won't stay here and listen to this right now. I won't, mom. Amaka! 
I mean, what is it? Amaka, mom is getting on my nerves. Amaka, what is it? Mom, don't be serious to that. I don't listen to this anymore, mom. Margaret, what is it? Mom is upsetting me seriously. It's okay. She's upsetting me. It's mom. okay. It's okay, Amaka. It's okay. Margaret, what is it? What is it? Amaka, you cannot run away from the truth. You can't continue to reject all these tutors and still expect to get married. Mom, mom, please. Please, I beg you in the name of God, leave me alone. I can't settle for two time in liars just because I want to get married. Please leave me alone, mom. Did you hear her, Margaret? Leave my daughter alone. Leave her alone, please. Darling, you are the cause of all this whole problem. You continue to encourage and pamper her, forgetting that she's a woman. And so? You want my daughter to get involved with what kind of degenerate idiots? To destroy all my investment in her? No. I don't want any idiot to make my daughter unhappy. Did you get that into your skull? She has to help herself. There's a limit to one checking out on one's house. There is no limit. As far as my daughter's happiness is involved. As soon as a worthy man comes, yes, my daughter will get married. Not all these charlatans all over the place. Gold diggers all over the place. Your daughter is no longer the Tata you know. All her mates are married. Is that what you think? Because she's brilliant, she's intelligent and she's good. And you think my daughter is an old woman? She's still a young girl. Have you forgotten you married me at 21? And so, did you go to the university? Huh? The answer is no. My daughter here is a university graduate. She has her master's. My two sons are out there abroad with their family. They don't think about me. They don't bother about me. She is the only one close to me. She believes in me. She runs my company. And you want one kind of degenerate idiot to come and settle where they did not do anything, reap where they did not sow? No, not my daughter. My daughter will marry a worthy man at the appropriate time. Did you get that? Amaka, don't worry. Don't mind your mother, okay? Daddy. Don't mind, Mary. Just come this way. Come and sit on me. Come, come, come this way. Come and sit. Sit on your dad. Sit on. Take your time. Did you get that? Take your dad. And don't joke with my daughter. Stop crying, okay? Mm -hmm. It's all right. It's all right. How about you shower, more, okay? You may leave now. So your ambition is for some this some of these degenerate idiots to come and reap where they did not so. Rubbish. Mention any flashy car. And it will be yours. Thank you, Daddy. <laughs> Look at your daddy. Give me a smile. Are you happy now? Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you. Don't mind your daughter, your mother, okay? Mr. Kennedy. Sir. The first time you came to my house, didn't I receive you well? You did. So how have I offended you? You've not offended me in any way. Mr. Kennedy, why did you decide to break my heart? <laughs> Sorry, sir. I don't understand. Do you know of Okonkwo and Ezima, how close they were? Okonkwo. Haven't you read things fall apart? Oh, I have, but I can't really place what happened there. I can't really remember what happened there. You are a fool. Kennedy, you are a liar and a cheat. No wonder my daughter left you. Nobody reads things fall apart and the person forgets about Okonkwo uh, 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 and Ezima, Okwefi's uh, 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 only daughter, only child. Nobody reads things fall apart and forgets them. You see, this is why I don't want gold diggers around my house. With all due respect, sir, I cannot have you accuse me wrongly. I am not a gold digger. I am a thriving businessman. Oh, Mr. Kennedy, you are challenging me in my house. Okay. Okay. You can go in and take my daughter by force. Oh, no, 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 no. Go and drag her away. Let me see how you do that. Sir, it's not what you think. It's not like that. But... But, but, but what? You are challenging me over my own daughter in my own house. Huh? Do you have a daughter? 
No, I'm asking you, Kenny, do you have a daughter? No, I don't. And you're challenging a man in his house over his daughter? Mr. Kennedy, you think you're still a small boy. At your age, I already had three children. Amaka is even my last child. And you are here dragging her with me. Sir, I am sorry. I, I'm not dragging your daughter with you. I, I love Amaka. Now get out of my house. Immediately. Sir, it has not gotten to that. I said get out of my house before I involve the security. Are you mad? Out. Out of my presence immediately. It's okay. You are tasking my patience. Bloody charlatans come, come into my house to mess my daughter up. After all my spendings, you want to waste my, my daughter's life with your miserable life. Out and out fast. Good diggers. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is Than what you think of God is not a man God is not a man He knows more than you do Oh God What is this? I've never been so humiliated in my whole life like this Because of a girl This arrogant man humiliated me I would have I would have I would have punched his face I would have given him a punch in his face and then the consequences. What is this? Oh. When you think you stand, be careful lest you fall. Cause the world is full of temptation and frustration. Be careful who you condemn. Makani Marechi, you might be the next in line. Careful who you condemn. Makani Marechi, you might be the next. Hey. Hey. Oh boy. What's up, man? I'm good. How are you? How are you doing? Well. Come on, go dress up. Let me go and um, show you some stops. What? Let's go and play the game you know how to play it most. Nah, I'm not in the mood, man. But besides, you just got here, man. Relax. I don't feel like it when I can. I just want to sit here and... Let's see, I know this whole thing is a big shock to you, but you can continue to dwell on it forever. Okay? You just have to find a way to snap out of it. Snap out of it? Yeah. <laughs> Ken, you have... You have a society where they, with a woman that you thought was the ultimate. A woman that meant everything to you. And suddenly... It just blows up in your face. How do you snap out of that? Bro, see, it's been seven weeks plus now. You can continue to dwell on this forever. Life goes on. Yeah, life goes on. <laughs> you just have to find a way to snap out of it. Or I swear, walk your way out of it. How? A good game is a sure bet. Come on, let me go and deal with you in the court. What did you say? Come, let me go and deal with you on the court. You can't stop now. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Stop. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> really? So, because I'm down, you think you can beat me? I always win you. Ha! Mm -hmm. Always? Really? Ken, always? Sure. One time. You beat me just one time. Out of ten. One time. <laughs> Ken, I taught you how to play tennis. I've got better than you. I you got... <laughs> <laughs> now I'm laughing. Are you happy? <laughs> yeah. Because you're very funny. Yeah. You are really very funny. Yeah, I'm, 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 you are very funny. You know what? I'm going to change you to something sporty so I can beat you today. That's more like it. No, I'll show you who the master is, really. Um, what? Let me formally inform you yeah, what's that up? Amaka has finally disappointed me after everything. Oh no, Ken. Stop it now. I'm so what? Sorry. What happened? 
boy, I cannot kill myself for that babe. I've tried so much. Hmm? Life goes on, I have to carry on with my life. Oh, yeah. No. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Come on, let's go. I will just as we go. Are you okay though? I'm good. Go dress up, let me go and deal with you. I'm waiting. Oh, yeah. Be back. Let me go and show you that I'm better than you now. Mr. Maduka, mm -hmm. I invited you today because I'm not quite happy with you. Crazy. You came to me early last year crying to me that you were in need and you needed help and I gave you the sum of 700,000 Naira which you promised to pay back in three weeks, maximum one month. You would agree with me? that it's the end of this year already. So if you do the math, you see it's been what? More than a year. So I've called you here to ask you what the problem is, because I need my money. Okay, my brother, uh, there's no problem actually, but things have not been easy for me. Maduka, you know, the things have not been easy for anyone in this country. We're all going through the same uh, yeah, struggle. You, I know, but you know, my own case is special. Because my what is commitment about your case. My commitment. To... What commitments? Uh, Mr. Maduka, I'm not happy with the way you're handling this matter. I'm trying to be as calm as I can because I have a lot of respect for you. Not only as an elder, but also as the chairman of our town union. So please do not make me talk to you in ways that you would not like. You're owing me. The least you can do is be humble and modest about it. What is what is different with your situation? What is going on? It's okay, my brother. Thank God you even have money to give to people. So I will suggest, please, please, don't be angry. I will suggest that you start uh, getting back your money from those people who are owing you big, big money before coming to this my small money. Are you suggesting that 700,000 naira is small money? But why, why do people do what they do? You borrow money from someone, you promise to pay back, and eventually you do not pay back. It is wrong. It is criminal, as a matter of fact. No, so what do, you, no, what do you want me to do? Do I run a charity organization where people just come, collect money and refuse to pay back? People are owing me left, right and centre. I'm upset, Maduka. Pay me what you owe me. Hey, Mike, you have, we have really changed since after that your wedding palaver. This is not you. Do not disrespect me, please. Don't talk about my marriage. I have not called you here for that. Can we, can we stick to what we're talking about? What am I getting my money? It's okay, it's okay, my brother. Let us stick to the matter. Okay. If not for some little, little issues, family issues, I would have paid up this small money since... You're still not... calling my money small money? Why are you trying very hard to get me upset? Mike, calm down. No, no, don't tell me to calm down. When am I getting my money? When are you paying me? I need a time frame. When, you know what? I, I'm giving you till the end of this month. If at the end of the month I don't get my money, I will take it up with you. I will take it up with you. Please leave my house for you. Look at the overlook and myself. Mike, you, you walked out on, on your chairman. Hey! Man, so what the power? Instead of saying that you're, you're still angry for getting married to one of Banja, you, you want to take it out on me. I will pay your money, it's nothing. Very short while I bring your money, I, this, this insult. Anyway, we have a meeting next month. You, you, you pay for this disrespect. Go on, my other man, sir. Go in. Where's my taxi, sir? I was with Michael yesterday. Mm. 
I want to discuss some, some business. You know, we do some business together. Oh, we are? Yes. Uh, <laughs> um, but he was not concentrating at all. In fact, he looked troubled. Oh, 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 oh. oh even oh. behaving strangely. You, you noticed it too? Yes. Hmm. Maduka, since that incident, Michael has never been himself. He has not recovered from it. Hey. Hmm. And that is why I am here. Hmm. Yes. I, I, I have come for us to think of a solution. Okay. Yes. We should not continue to allow him to wallow in this kind of mood as if uh, what, what happened? What is it? This is the time to get him another wife. Yes, so that he will begin to forget about that uh, that useless one that uh, he married by mistake. Hmm. Maduka, no. I've thought about it. Mm -hmm. But <laughs> I'm afraid. Okay. Michael doesn't listen to me. Why? I'm a Why would he not listen to his only sister? For what? <laughs> hey! God of mercy. You don't know what is going on. You don't know what if he man I men on Maduka. Yes. Do you know how many girls I recommended to Michael before he married that uncircumcised girl that disgraced us? Really? Our good Christian girls from our town and even neighboring towns. He kept saying that he didn't love any of them. Lo Logging it. John Moga love ghost. What, what is love? You Michael love ghost. What, what is love? Walk, walk. Thank you, love. Who, who is talking about love this day? Wow. In our own time, was there anything like love? Let your love. My, my, my own marriage was it not in my primary sis. Eh? I came back from school one day. They've already packaged somebody for me. I met some people sitting. I was, hey, Caro, some people are here for you. They just bundled me to the man's house. Okay, say, man. Okay, say, man. Marriage is when you get there. If you find love, fine. If you don't find love, you embrace Christ in our mumwa. Everything in our You can only succeed by His grace being prayerful. Exactly. That is the only way. Are we not still in the marriage now? Ask me. Have, have we all died? Ask me, man. Okay, okay, Lord. Okay, well, eh? Okay, well, Lord. Yeah. Know... So this is the time to get him a decent girl. Mm -hmm. Yes, and he will not argue. Are you sure? Very sure. It is condition that makes the crayfish bend. Oh, yeah. Yes, so with the condition he is into now, he will not argue. Maduka, eh? Mm -hmm. This your wisdom baffles me. You mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Do you know that I have one ready? Uh -huh. Just all I need is permission. And uh, mm, you see the girl. <laughs> Good Christian girl. What are we talking about? Decent. When I say decent, and a prayer warrior. Mm. Because there in the Bible, Sirach 7 verse 19 says that you do not give certain chance to miss the wife God gave you. Mm. Because who finds a good wife? Finds God. A good thing. I, I, I know that verse in the Bible. Huh? I know the place. How can this happen to me? Hi. How can somebody have you and, and, and marry a wrong wife? My dear. Oh my God. All in the name of modern. By modern huh? Where is modern? All in the name of modern life. There's nothing like modern when it comes to marriage. Nothing. Marriage is God's own institution. Ah, on what definition? Marry the woman you want. On what definition? God, God, will, God will package it for you. What is what is love? Huh? <laughs> Michael just called me one day. I am getting married. Just like that. Did you ask the Holy Spirit about it? Is, was he guided by the Holy Spirit? Did you fast and pray for this marriage? Huh? And we, the elders, we did not even ask their proper what questions. What is the result? That's the way we ask questions. No. We you ask know, questions. Du during our own time, they will come the father, without you knowing. The grandfather, everybody. You Their ask lineage. Them, whether they have, do they have uh, uh, this kind of Christians? A, do they have madness in their, in their blood? Vegans. 
Mm-hmm. Do they do this mm-hmm. or die untimely? Do they have, do they ma- have, do they have madness in their blood? Oh, I'm sure that this girl must have a trace of madness. That is the point. That is why she behaved like that. That is the point. Yeah. I need to go there. Yeah, they don't let me. Yeah, they don't let me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you are sharing the wisdom now. <laughs> <laughs> Sister, I've told you. Not now. I need some time to myself. I'm not interested. Michael, how can you not be interested? Because I am not interested. Why? Because I need some time to myself. Alright, so when the time is right, I'll do the need for But for now, right, right now is me time. When would the time be right? When? When will it be right? It's, oh, why are we even to? It's barely three months. As a matter of fact, less than three months, I got out of that toxic marriage. And here you are, trying to talk me into another marriage. Why? What, what do you mean? I don't get what you're saying. Did your wife die and you are mourning her? No. The devil came into your life through the back door to destroy you, but God saved you. So, the only thing you can do to thank God is getting married to the right girl immediately and shame the devil. That's all. I'm not interested. How can you not be interested? Because I am not interested. Why? Michael, why? Do you want our father's lineage to end like this? Is that what you want? Tell me. What what are you on about? And what lineage? What am I dying anytime soon? Heavens forbid that. So why we have why are you talking like that? Michael, you're not getting any younger. Your mates are done with childbearing, and here we are still talking about you choosing a wife. Yes, because life happens. Michael Beacon. Eh? I am tired of friends asking questions. When will this be? I want to carry your children. I am your mother now and I'm the mother you are seeing. Please. Michael Wendem, please. Why do you always want to make me sad? Why do you like seeing me sad? Michael, please. I one name. In the name of heavens, receive wisdom. Receive wisdom and listen to me. People want them. I will not deceive you. Please. Do you know that no when Bogabo eh? If you marry late and bear children, Omugadika monkey. Do you want that? I am telling you, in all honesty. You need to bear children now that your blood is still young. Michael one them receive wisdom. No. Hey, Michael, my brother. If you go to the girl, eh? Benefits girl. Everywhere is intact. Very natural. Oburo all this gear of pompous go everywhere. Both breasts, nash, long eyelashes, long everything. She is very homely. A good Christian girl. In fact, she's a prayer warrior in the church. Believe me. Mm. Yeah, I... I remember her. Oh, you do? Yes, I saw her two years ago when I came to the village for, for Christmas. Exactly. <laughs> we were in the choir together. She joined as a small girl. Yeah. She's the vocal lead. She will that is it. Oh, you will love this girl. <laughs> is she educated? Yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, what's her level of education? She went to school like her mates. Well, yes, I I I like the thing that she did, but I mean what's her for specifics, what's her qualification? Is she looking for work? You are going to marry her, not to employ her. Well, I understand that, but she cannot be redundant in marriage. 
Yes, she has to bring something to the table. I need to know my prospective wife's educational background. Her level of qualification. This is the 21st century, sister. You don't expect me as your brother to get married to an illiterate now, do you? Oh, the ma. She has NCE. What's that? I didn't care what's that. What's NCE? She's a qualified teacher. On her cousin will be one of the community primary school in the village and on her church. Why, yeah. She's a vocal lead. Onya can sing for Nigeria. She can sing for you. Sister? Look, her singing alone will bring the angels here. Oh, when you know about the most you see from east west, your house will be covered. Not to talk when she prays. She's a prayer warrior. Ah, uh, see. So how do we um uh, my goodness? How do we begin to have this conversation with her people? <laughs> Michael, when name you don't need to worry. I already told her that my brother would marry her. Before you brought in that characterless nonsense of what you girl from, from, from the coven of demons. What? I don't understand. What? You told her that I would marry her? Yes. Without consulting? Huh. It's fine, sister. Go ahead. You were saying something. You don't know this girl's name. Esther. She will be the Esther of your life. All we need to do is to reopen the discussion with her. Then notify her people of our visit. Oh, well, everything will go on well. Believe me. We are from the same village. So we know her very well. I personally, Malo Ebe, in fact, let's do this. You will not regret it. Oh, my name. Please. You know what? It's okay. So yes. I take it that um, <clears throat> you'll be going to the village? Yes. This weekend. Oh, this weekend. <laughs> okay. I guess we'll have to set the ball rolling. Oh! God, you are great. I am that I am, you are great. Ebo of Judah, you are great. They are holla, I say, I holla. <laughs> Sister? Yes, my dear. I have neighbors. William, well. uh, no. um, let me see what I have here. <laughs> hey, one name I land the gun. You are going to the village. Yes. So this is uh, uh, ten thousand naira, sister. <coughs> Transport. Michael, what will I do with ten thousand naira? I, I don't understand. In Yemi, I can we go to bread in Kenya when I get to the village. What what are you trying to do? Michael, whenever it comes to me, you are stingy. But I know that you used to give that useless and characterless girl up to 100,000 naira for flights. And I ask you one name. Mba aeroplane. Will the angels stop worshipping God? Will they stop singing praises? Hallelujah, God, who say that? Sister? Yes, sir. Do we have an airport in our village? Are you flying business class to the village? My friend, please, if so you... So, how is it that 10,000 now would not be enough for you? If you're serious, give me money. Give me up to 150, eh? At least, I, 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 I will chatter a boss or, 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 or Sienna so that I'll be praying on the way. Now consult to the heavens. I can't, I can't pray as I want in, in, the, in, in, the, in the commercial distance. What do you mean? Hello? Yes. You see? Forgive me. I totally forgot. I totally forgot. You know what? Just please hold and stay on the phone, please. Um, sister, I have to take this call. It's very, very important. And as it is, I understand that this marriage is more important to you than it is to me. So this is the 10,000 now. When you make up your mind, eh? <clears throat> you take this money. and touch at 2,500 now. You keep the change. You see your problem? Eh? You can't have two minutes discussion with him. He's always on phone, computer, flying from one place to the other. Eh? Where he will meet all these rubbish and nonsense people.
Michael, don't allow the devil to walk on this so We must get this decent girl. King Alija Buto for one day again. But it will not work for them. I must hear a cry of a baby in this house. I must hear the cry of a baby in this house. Whether the devil likes it or not. Hi. All I do with 10,000 naira now. Okay. At least I can enter bus from my house to the park, 200 naira. From the park to the village. And, uh, by and large, 5,000 naira will take me to the village and come back. Then I'll have 5,000 naira for my Bible study and the donation in the church. It's all right. Hey, devil, you are a liar. Devil, you cannot succeed. You cannot get me through my brother. I am going to pray him out. I am going to pray him out. That principalities and powers, whichever way you are gathering, in seven falls you will scatter. Not with my family. Not with my brother. Ban. <laughs> the possible. Never walk away. <sighs> Clement, how are you? I'm fine now. <laughs> Have you greeted your new madam? Oh, greet her well. Oh, our new wife. Oh, can I address? <laughs> bend down. No, you come, you come to my car. Oh, bend down, bend down. Bend down. Bend down. Bend down. Bend down. Hey, hey, that is the spirit. Get her box from the booth. Oh, no problem. No. <laughs> no, you're welcome. Eh? The Holy Spirit accepts, Olya. I'm sick of it. Eba, Eba. Yeah, it's here. Relax. <laughs> you're home. This is your home. This is the gate man's house. Anytime your husband comes back, you will tell the gate man to open the gate. You don't need to stress yourself. The Holy Spirit is blessed. Go, 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 I know. Yeah. But boy, boy's house. Hmm? Mm. If you need dry cleaner, oh, Kuko, just mention that person's name. Fan of here. Mm. You call. Be careful with that bag, oh. Before Holy Ghost are talking John Joloko. <laughs> My dear, mm. let's go inside. <laughs> Let us go inside. <laughs> this is your home. When you use this and check this for it, <laughs> hey, my dear, I bless this home. I bless this house. Hey. <laughs> I think I'm, yeah. I don't carry the load to put them for upstairs. Uh, thank you very much. I will see you later. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh, then Ali, welcome. Uh, I'm ready to pray to you. Don't worry, I will see you later. Oh, I will see Clement, I will see you later. Behave yourself. Uh -huh. Oh, my dear. <laughs> hey, Esther, my daughter. This is your home. Eh? Come and sit down, mom. Sit down, decent hey, wife. What you mean? Obviously, me. Correct leather. As you can see, the house is well kept. Hmm? All you need to do is relax. You see that door there? That is the master's bedroom. Eh? I want you to pick your bag. Go inside that room and occupy. You know what I mean. <laughs> you don't need to be afraid of anybody. We have paid your dowry. So you are now the madam 
of the house. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very You're much. You're welcome, my dear. <laughs> One more thing. What is it? Uh, what about the wedding? You know I'm a choir member. Uh, the... Esther. Calm down. Yeah. Relax. You need to trust me. Where is your faith? Where is your faith? <laughs> Very soon, my brother will be done with that girl. The court will divorce my brother from that girl and he will wed you. You don't need to be afraid of anything. Relax. I insisted on you coming to stay here so that no nonsense, characterless girls around town will near him. Come and occupy. That is what I said. Occupy. It's no problem. I'm holding my there is money. Mm -hmm. All you need to do is keep the house clean, cook for him, give him food on time, and as when you do. Order. <laughs> Moreover, you need to pray. Yes. My brother is very, very weak in prayer. Uh, that is why the devil always comes through him. Pray, 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 pray. Pray like there is no tomorrow. What every Bible? And you see the devil. Of us. And you never devil. Mugu fala. I don't know if you're getting it. Has he forgotten that song? You do not lie. You do not fail. What is hard for you to do? It doesn't exist. It never, never exists. You do not lie, you do not fail. What is that for you to do? It doesn't exist, oh. And it can never, never exist, oh. Uh, so I come to celebrate with you. Uh, it's a wonderful thing that has happened. Look, uh, look, yes, uh, I told your sister about this. Uh, this has to be done. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening, sir. Hey. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Oh. Good girl. Yes, sir. Fill it up, fill it up. That's my spell. Straight. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. Wonderful, it's chilled. Hmm? Thank you. I can see you're going to be a good wife to our brother. Thank you, sir. I am sure he told you about me already. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am the chairman of our town union in this uh, city. And now that you're married to my brother, you have become a member of the union. <laughs> and I have automatically become your chairman. Uh, all right, sir. God bless you, sir. Uh, God bless you too. Uh, God has already blessed you. Yes. Um, your husband is a perfect gentleman. Everything you need in this life, he has. Yeah, look at look around. Look around. Look at outside. Cars everywhere. Beautiful house. Uh, all you need to do now is to relax and enjoy yourself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sir. Yeah. Look at him. He more than just a call. Make sure you don't give him stress. In our family, in our kindred, we don't need stress. We are beautiful people. <laughs> okay, Smartless people. <laughs> okay, sir. So I have to go inside now. I have something on the fire. Okay, you have something on the fire. Uh, that is better. That's good news. <laughs> okay, well done. Hey. This is what we are talking about. Ah. Yes, a home girl <laughs> with home training. Right. Here yeah, you can see, and a good place that for that matter. Mm. Yes. So all you need to do now is to settle down and face your business squarely without any uh, distractions mm. like before. Mm? Mm -hmm. Well done. Thank you. Uh, one last thing. Mm. What? In the next nine months. That. <laughs> I want to hear the cry of. <laughs> a baby in this house. 
We'll see about that. We'll see about that. Eh? Uh, <laughs> no story, though. Uh, no more stories. Yeah? We'll see about yes. that. Well done, well done, well done. Well done. You have done well. Thank you. You have done well. Thank you. And that thing in the fire. Uh, I hope there's chicken and chips this time. That's my spec. You are my house. You'll be taking care of it. Well done. Congratulations. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I told Caroline, your sister, about this. And I said, let us move it. Let us move it. He needs it. And it is done. <laughs> I sleep on the bed, of course. It's the bed with you, yes. Uh, no, when we have no wedded, I cannot try. Come on, Esther, why are you talking like this? I'm your husband, you're my wife. I have taken care of your bride price. That is not what the Bible says. Sleeping with a man without a wedding is fornication, and it will lead someone to hellfire. Me, I don't want to go to hellfire. Ah, why are you talking like this? This was clearly talked about and agreed upon. Why, why, why are you saying this? Now? Sleeping with me was not part of the agreement. Pico. Have I said that one? You know what? I have not said I want to do anything with you. I'm just saying that it's inappropriate for you to sleep on the floor. Can you just get on the bed and just lie down and be comfortable? You don't know what Auntie Carol told me. What did she tell you? Esther, get up. Come to bed now. Yeah, I don't trust men at all. Please, Biko, don't lead me into temptation, Biko. Get God is not a man, he knows more than you do. Life is deeper than what is life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man, God is not a man, he knows more than you do. God is not a man. God is not a man, he knows more than you do. When you think you stand, be careful lest you fall, cause the world is full of temptation and frustration. <laughs> Now you may kiss the bride. Look, it's I, I, I was I was streaming. It, it's not what you think. It is what you think. Hey, hey, boy, boy. Hold on, hold on. Ah, I was saying it is not what I think. It's not what you think. Come on. Mm, I didn't mean I didn't stop you now. I'm a man. I am comfortable here. Go. I'm fine here. Be dead. You can't sleep on the floor now. Huh? Is it your business? Hmm? Is it your sleeping? I won't be people. Hey! I'm not here 
wearing tights. Biko, let me go and get my tights. Even Nika. I can never put it in the key bag. Let me get my tights, Biko. This is exactly what I want. This is it. This is more than love charm. This will come Kennedy to me forever. Yes. Oh, this is what I need. I have to get the number. Let me. I hope she dropped her number. Yes. Zero eight zero. Yes, five seven six two. Yes, that's it. You, Kennedy, must be mine. How did this woman know there are ladies like me out here? Good. Hello, Ma. Good afternoon, Ma. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I just came off your page. Yes, about the love charm. I'm very much interested. 
Yes, ma, the love gum, to be more precise. I want that particular one that will gum him forever. Yes, 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 yes. Really? No, 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 no. The price is not at all the problem. I can actually give you double the money as long as I get him to myself. Oh. Yes, I want him forever. Yes, ma. Tomorrow? Of course, no, 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 it's not a problem. I can actually be there like right now. Oh, tomorrow. Okay, ma. Thank you so much. Please send me your account number. I would like to transfer the money right away. Yes. Oh, yes. Thank you, ma. Thank you. Yes, I'm a love gum lover. Yes. Thank you, ma. Okay, thank you. All right, Ma. <laughs> Kennedy. Kennedy, here I come. I'll have you all to myself. <laughs> Go see. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I, I wasn't expecting you at all. I know. You're welcome. Thank you. Actually, I, I, I came to tell you that. Okay. I'm in love with you. Yes, I mean, I know. I know you have someone in your life, but it doesn't stop me from loving you. I just wanted you to know that. Rosie. Yes? I just don't want you to feel that I dislike you. No, I, 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 I don't, but, you know, I never thought of having any kind of relationship with you. Come on, Kennedy, you don't think about love. It just happens. The same way it happened to me concerning you. It's... It's just sad you don't feel the same way for me. But it's okay. Bye. Ngoz. Let's come back. Um, I wouldn't just allow you to go away like that, okay? At least, let's go inside and have some drink. Uh, you, you, you're in my house, okay? I hope I'm not forcing myself on you. No, 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 not at all. Are you no, sure? Come on, come on.
What's that for? Why did you do that? What is what? Um, you, you can clearly see that I was watching a program. I, I, you just walked in here and you think, why? Those immoral things are the things that cause problem in your life. Watch the word of God with me. Yes. And see the wonderful miracles of God. What's the word of God? See, see, see me. See miracles. Esther, please, the next time you come to the living room and you see me watching a program, can you not do this? I don't like it. It is very disrespectful. It's not right. Let me enjoy my program. When I'm done, you have something you want to watch, you go ahead and watch it. You don't have to like it, my dear husband. Yes. Even the Bible says in Matthew 7, 13, that the road to righteousness is not war. And that is why most people will go to hellfire. Because they choose the easy way. And I don't want you, my dear husband, to go to hellfire. So let's watch, <laughs> let's watch this program. Hey, see me. Oh, the crippled is about to walk. Yes. <laughs> Are you watching? Slept good? Yes. What about you? Ah, I slept well. Got up early. As you can see. You know, it's uh, my birthday today, so it's um, only normal that I'm a bit all over the place with my emotions, eh? Oh, birthday? Yes, it's my birthday today. I don't do birthday again. Why? It is demonic. How could you say a thing like that? Who says but there's a demonic? No. No. Not. A friend of mine died on her birthday five years ago, and since then I know birthdays are demonic. Well, um Esther. I'm sorry to hear about your friend's passing, but Birthdays are not demonic, okay? What happened was a coincidence that these things happen. People all over the world still celebrate birthdays. And people unfortunately die, you know. So it does not take anything away from birthdays, okay? Please, me, I don't know about other people. Oh. I only know about myself. <laughs> oh, it is satanic. Birthday is demonic. Nico, come and run if it was a birthday. Okay.
Is that all? Like, is that all you have to say? Esther! What? Well, that is really all you have to say? On my birthday! So why are you so insensitive to my feelings? It's my birthday and that's all you could come up with. What have I done now? Please, oh, I don't have strength for your argument. I just said that. I don't do birthdays <laughs> anymore. Like, I don't celebrate birthdays. That is just it. Okay, hold on a second, please. You don't celebrate birthdays? Yes. But 25th of December every year, mm -hmm. you celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ. Yes. That's his birthday. <laughs> you celebrate it. Jesus Christ, our Lord and personal Savior, the only Son of God, the creator of the whole universe. If you say that, gonna die. But you see mortals, I don't celebrate their birthdays because I don't even celebrate my own birthday. I just forgot to say I'm Ibu Jesus Christ. If I open up a name, yes. Anything that concerns God is what I do. Because. We all have our hmm. Because. All is full of This message is from a dirty, despicable, miserable, and unworthy lady. But this lady loves you from the bottom of her heart. Always bear that in mind. Happy birthday, my love. My nightmare. Kenny, I did, I did, I don't come here. <laughs> it's my birthday, I know. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Amen. 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 <laughs> of course now you can stop by again. Ah no, nothing too loud, I mean, you know. Just a little get together with a few friends. Eh? <laughs> thank you, bro. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kenny. After your hustle for the day, it wore down now. Eh? Kagai is my <laughs> Oh yes, a little cake, you know, just to uh, make it look um, celebratory, yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for calling. Thank you, darling. Yeah, I'll see you soon. Yeah. Bye. Uh...
you do? Yeah. before you eat. I do. Uh, come on, let's pray. You pray. Okay. Father Lord, we thank you for this wonderful food that we eat. We enjoy it. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. So tell me, does she cook this good? Who? Your fiance I met here the other day. Um, don't worry about her, okay? I don't discuss my relationship. Oh, I'm sorry. You're truly a gentleman, you know. The food is nice. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> happening and still happening. So tell me about it. I don't catch Kennedy. I have him here right now. Sure? Mm -hmm. Since when? He won't understand. In fact, I have something to show you. Okay. That might give you some closure. <laughs> there you go. Jesus. Who gave you this money? Who do you think? Kennedy did. He did? Oh my, you're so lucky. Oh, did you say luck? Yes. It's not luck, darling. I worked for it. 
I went places. Places? How? <laughs> Come on, Ify. So you think anything in this life happens for nothing? No way. It doesn't. Hey, but I really do not know you again. No. What Don't. are you really turning into? Don't worry. Give me my money first. Very soon, you will know me. But right now, I need to catch some rest. It's been marathon fun out there. You need it. If you know, <laughs> you know. <gasps> I have a dream that one day, my boy Kennedy and myself will walk down the aisles and walk mm -hmm. and walk. Oh yes, he will say I do. And I would say I do. <laughs> for invited. Of course I will be. I can't miss it for anything. I know. <laughs> Best, catch you later. All right. It was you. Listen, I know you. I know you. Even in the dark, I know you. I know you. I know your body. I know you. I know everything about you. See, now, I, I, I knew it was you. I, I, I could spot you from afar. See, now, even if I see you a thousand miles away, I would know it's you. My goodness, Tina, I miss you, huh? Please, let's talk. Let's talk, Tina, please. Please, please come with me. Mike, no. Please. No! Just like I said, no! Mike, no! Mike, leave me alone. Just hear me out. I said no. For you to eat your food. Mm? Yes, I don't even know when I do stuff. <coughs> I'm not hungry. Eh? You know what? I'm, I'm not hungry, I'm okay. 
How can you say that now? What do you want me to do? I said I am not hungry. Leave me. I prepared your fifth vital. I'm not hungry. I want to sleep. Hey! You're drunk. Ah. No. I cannot live with a drunk adult. My Bible says. My Bible says what? No, say it. Finish it. Finish it. Your Bible said what? What did your Bible say? Show me where the Bible said that one cannot take alcohol. Little alcohol that I took. You're the one that is drunk. You're drunk. Very drunk. Not me. You're drunk. You think I don't know the smell of alcohol? I know! My late father was a drunkard. He would drink and fall inside the gutter when we were living in Oju Eleba, Lagos. My mother talked and talked, but he would not listen. One day, he drank and was staggering along the road. A car knocked him down and killed him. The car ran away. That was how left Lagos back to the village. Please, oh, I don't want me and my children to suffer like my mother. Biko, I don't live with a drunkard. I don't want them. What's him? I'm drunk. You're very drunk. Hi. I'll go at the drunk. I'll say I'm drunk. Hmm, me, I cannot sleep with a drunkard, though. Auntie Karo must hear this. Eh? Iba Gosia, Iba Data, this food is here waiting for you. How is it possible that after preparing food, it seems that you're not hungry? Onyege Elia, who will eat it? You will come, come down here and eat this food, though. Hey! Drunkard, what? Hmm. Hey, hey. Now, if I'm a little bit something that happened to my mother will happen to me. Or they are possible. It's not possible at all. And Tika Romos hear this. I cannot live with a drunk heart. Eh? It is against my faith. It is against my belief. Eh? Why would you drink? Children of God don't drink. And you are expected to be one. What's even what you could? Mrs. Adekunle, I have reminded you about this report two other times and it's still not ready. Why? Ma'am, I'm working on it. Ah. You know, I have to collect materials from the field manager in order to... That is what you said the last time. And time is running out. That reminds me. You always come to the office late. I wonder why. Ma'am, I'm a married woman. Mm. You know, I have to take care of my husband and my children before coming to work. It's not easy. Everybody has their own domestic issues. We all have our own domestic issues. If we allow them to affect our work, the company won't function properly. Mm. Ma'am, you don't understand what it means to wake up early, feed your children, cook for them, eh? and, and, and turn to your husband for his own wahala before you take the children to school. Madam. I understand all that. You are not the only married woman in this company. The point is, we are running behind schedule. I need to collect those materials before the forthcoming AGM of the company. Please, get serious with the work you are paid to do. I want that report on my desk latest on Friday. Okay, my you. Ah, uh, Mr. Sadekuli, you can go now. Go and do the work you are paid to do. Thank you. Eri, I don't know what is wrong with that girl, that Amaka girl. Of food. She was more here when we built this company with her father. But now she has come to live from where she did to. That's the problem I have with all the spoiled, pampered children. Hmm. They don't even have respect. Hmm. Ha -ha. Well, I reported that to her father. But he didn't do anything, no. Hmm. For where? Wait, wait, wait. What do 
What do you expect him to do? He even leaves all the work for her to do. My friend, I heard that when he retires, she'll become the next MD. Ah? Uh, yes. Uh, oh, Lord, my dear. God forbid. Hmm, Amy. Hmm. I cannot work under that small girl as MD. It's not possible. Hmm. Hmm. I'd rather go and open a provision store in my street. Hmm. Don't worry. We'll put her in her place. We'll surely put her in her place one day. Don't worry. Benny, we will surely put her in her place. Me? Hmm. We were here when she came. I will be here when she will go. Hmm. Yeah, nah. You go see later, eh? pains in my stomach. Yes, it's growing bigger and stronger by the day. Huh? Are you say, saying I have to undergo fibro surgery? No, 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 no I, I heard it's unsafe. Will I still be able to have children, doctor? No, no, doctor, I'm scared. Uh, yes, I'm, I'm coming to your office right away, doctor. Okay, doctor. Only sick and cannot come to work. Hey, hmm. my friend, that is what I had. It is the Holy Ghost fire that is burning her. Mm. Yes. Mm. I tell you. Hey. I told you. <laughs> the God I serve mm. does not sleep. Ah. I went down on my knees <laughs> and mm. dared this God to come and settle my matter with this girl that hates me for no reason. I just ah. See my friend. Ah. It is the Holy Ghost fire that is burning this girl. Benny. Uh, mm, I heard her stomach wants to burst. <laughs> but I think it's a result of abortion. <laughs> abortion? Abortion, no more abortion. <laughs> Wait, you see all this holier than that she's doing? <laughs> she's pretending. Oh, more pretense. Hey. <laughs> Behind our back, hey. this kind of people do all sorts of things. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. I wish I could recover. Ah, oh. I don't wish I anything. Mm. Ah. I want her to recover, but let it not be quick. Ah. So I can have time and breathe in some air in this office. I beg, let me go to my office before they say I talk too much. Ah. My sister. Good evening, you. Hey, you, come here. Where have you been? I've been calling you. I've been worried. I've been worried about you. What for? I told you I went to church for choir practice. Yes, you told me. But you usually get back here at 7 p.m. It's 9 p.m. What's all this suspicion for? Eh? What's it all about? Esther, this is not about suspicion. It's about your safety. Should I not be worried about you? Well, I switched off my phone. I was in the Lord's presence. That is the point. Okay, 
Well, my point is this. Right now, you should be apologizing. All right? For being incommunicado and not to try to claim rights. Claiming rights will not take you anywhere. Oh, please, 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 be Kokwa. Stop looking at me with the eyes of that your former prostitute wife. Yes, I am a decent woman from a decent home. Eh? The problem here is that you think that everybody is like her. Um, Esther. Listen to me. Let this be the last time you make reference to my former wife. Don't do it again. Ever. Ever. Don't try it. Don't try it. Then stop suspecting. Will you keep quiet? I'm talking. You lack respect. That's your problem. You're so rude and uncultured. Look at you. I'm talking and you're talking back at me. Are you out of your mind? I'm talking about your sin. Listen. The next time. The next time you try this, I will deal with you. You call yourself a Christian. Holy Spirit filled. And then you're talking back at me like that. Your character sinks. Eh? Me? Esther Meribe. You, Esther, whatever. The next time you make reference to my former wife, in any of our conversations, I will throw you out of this house and take you back to that timid village you come from. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? Get out. Get out. I think you're going to church, eh? And your child. See how she looks. Oh God. It does not mean we failed. We all have our flaws. Where on it come Man is full of imperfection. Maduka, I am tired. I don't know what is wrong with Michael. Eh? Why does he hate this decent and obedient girl? A good Christian girl for that matter. A girl who does not want any trouble. Let it not be that the other girl transferred her, her, her evil spirit and spiritual whatever that is disturbing her to my brother. Mm, but, but no, 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 no. I think it is the usual husband and wife uh, quarrel. Uh, we all have it now, don't we? Maduka, this one is too much. Eh? You don't understand. This girl does everything he wants. Yet, Michael treats her like a maid. What can I say? He doesn't even touch her. Eh? You mean... <laughs> the dog says people who, who have Botox do not know how to use it. So what did he say is the problem? Oh no, you say I'm going to call now, go back and go. Which one? Do I know for Mike? Do I know for Mike? All he said was that she resisted him before. Because of that, he doesn't want the game. Yeah. And I call the Akoka. Can you do the Akoka here? Yeah. Some, something is wrong somewhere. This is not ordinary. How can somebody have that kind of a uh, papa around him and he's, uh, he's not in uh, You asking me? Yeah? I am talking about a Christian virgin, not even a worldly virgin. And Mike does not touch her. <laughs> <laughs> no, I want kind of people. Don't say those who are put out. You don't know to, how to sit down. Please, I am begging you to go and see Michael and talk to him. I am tired. Eh? Because if you see how he was shouting at me, I prayed very hard before this marriage. And the Holy Spirit assured me that this marriage will work. It will work. And it must work. We are here now. It, it must work. Oh. Ah, is it not our marriage? This is our marriage. It hey. must work. I'll, I'll go and talk to him. Don't worry. Ah, uh, for what now? That guy has come. Oh, I'll be, be going. I'll be go. What is it? Uh, okay. Daddy has started vomiting again. Yeah. This man will not allow me to drink water and keep cup. Okay, she go. I'm coming. Okay, ma. Hey. Is 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 vomiting? Maduka, please, I'm coming. Do you need my attention? No, 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 no. I, I can't handle that. Oh, please. Take care of I am waiting for your feedback. No, I will see my today, today, today. Biko, do not yeah, forget. Mua. Ah, this no. is our marriage. Do not forget. Yeah, forget. Are you waiting for me? Uh, uh, no, I will leave. Uh, I, will, I have to go. I'm going straight to his house. Uh, straight from, from Biko, here to Biko. his house. Biko. One, one hand, one hand. I will tell you the other. I'm talking to him. In mm. fact, as you are driving back, eh, be meditating so that the Holy Spirit will be with you. 
Yeah. Oh, there you go. I, I will go. This woman is a very wicked woman. I knew it. So she wants me to go and settle husband and wife matter when I have my own hips in the house and her own like a mountain. She will neglect it and wants me to go and settle another person. Nonsense. When you went to marry that rude girl from the village, didn't you know she would disgrace you? Caroline, I'm asking you, didn't know the guy would disgrace you? Live with it. Nonsense. Look at my lover. Hey, the one that actually worries me is uh, that Michael does not touch this girl. Hey, <laughs> nah, in the story. How can somebody have this kind of papa around him and he does not touch her? No, wait, 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 wait. Just imagine me having that young succulent girl beside me in the night and I don't touch her. <laughs> See the okay. This life, eh? this life no balance. So. <laughs> this life no balance. Look at the Humpty Dumpty in my house. Like this. And I'm still managing. Oh. Not to talk about uh, this succulent Christian virgin. <laughs> this life no balance. This life no balance. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than what you think of. God is not Mike. Yeah. You're not looking bright at all. What's what is it? What's the problem? I'm fine. I'm, I'm okay. Just um, work pressure, you know. I'm trying to cope with um, <clears throat> the arise of my clients' projects that I that I have on my table, but I'm okay. I'm fine. What's up? Okay, I I really don't want to disturb you this period, but there is something very important. Okay, sure. I would love to discuss with you. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Um, you know, since Amaka left. Yeah. I've decided to give a break to this marriage of a thing, okay? Mm. But someone came into my life unexpectedly and changed all that. She's proven to be very serious and then, um, you know. So I intend to get married to her. Yeah. Nice. That's good. Very good. Huh? She's someone you know. Really? Yeah. Okay, who is she? Ngozi. Ngozi. Tina's maid of honor. Really? Yeah. Since when? For some time now, it's been roller coaster between us so far. Uh, but I don't know how you feel about it. Well, how can I feel? You know, I'm just only going to have to tap into your happiness. If you're happy, then we're happy. I mean, if she makes you happy, you know, she makes you think of family and marriage, it's a good thing. You know her better than all of us, right? So if you think that she's the one, why not? Yeah, she's madly in love with me and I, <laughs> yeah, I love her too. It's a good thing. I've always said that it's good that a man marries a woman who loves him more than he loves Um, I'm going to update you in the next few days. Yeah. Because I'll be going to see her people very soon. Already? Yeah. It's fine, but if you ask me, I'll say, take your time. Don't be in a hurry. Hmm? If you know what I mean. Sure, sure. Uh? Sure. <laughs> uh. But overall, it's a good thing. So I think that um, congratulations is an order. Cheers. Uh? <laughs> Yeah, I'm there. I'm by the plaza. 
Okay, I'm standing there. I'm still waiting for you. Where are you? I don't seem to see you. Please start coming out. Okay. Surprise the person. I, I, I didn't know you until I I swear to you, please, 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 please just, just take this for taxi or whatever it is that you're here to shop for. Please, 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 please I beg you, please. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm just so sorry. I'm so sorry. So sorry. I'm 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 so sorry. Michael, my mother called today. She said she is sick. You know she has diabetes. I don't want my mother to die. You. Eh? So um, I need a hundred thousand naira to take her to the hospital. Please. You know you've not actually given me money ever since I came. Eh? The only thing you give to me is small, small change for food. Hmm? Me, your wife. Because I need money to take my mother to the hospital. Oh? Michael, are you not the one that I'm talking to? What kind of a man are you? I am here talking to you and you're thinking about somebody that you don't even know where she is. Somebody that might be busy now, giving herself free of charge to other men. I don't even know the kind of juju she used in bewitching you. Because I have tried. I have prayed. Fasting and praying. Ah, eh? For you to be delivered. For you to be free. Come back. Hey. Shami, stop. Be foolish. Keep quiet. Enough. Mama. A fool. Oh yes. You're nothing but a big, big fool. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Shut up! Have I not warned you? Have I not warned you? Have I not warned you never to bring up my former wife in our conversations? That's my past. Stop bringing her up. We are beat. Why are you doing this now? See you, um, Michael. If this is your own way of not giving me the money that I used to take my mother to the hospital, I say can see. Because if you take home the money, you must give me the money. It will not work. Please, I need to take my mother to the hospital. Ah. You know what you are? A village tap. That's what you are. Wait. What are you doing in my life? How did I even allow my sister to convince me to package this trash and drop in my life? Listen, I've had just about enough of your nonsense. But I assure you, it won't be for long. You hear me? It will not be for long. This will end pretty soon. It is a matter of time.
Did he just call me a village tout? I'm a trash. Hello, Auntie Caro, pick this call. Hello, Auntie Caro. Auntie Caro, everything is not fine at all. Is it not because of that useless thing your brother got married to before that makes him maltreat me every day in this house? No. Auntie, I don't think this whole thing will work. It won't work at all. I cannot drink water and keep cup in this house. There is nothing that I do that is ever correct. And his laws are too much. You should have done it this way. But do it this way. Do it that way. That's him. Anrozim. Adam Anrozim. Please. And see, I want you to come and take me out of this place before he kills me. Come, Obiko. Okay. Hi. Hey, Michael called me a village tout. Hi. I'm a village tout. I'm a village tout. Hi. 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 Oh, my kids are the one. I don't trust him. No, 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 no. I won't marry again. No, Pico. I think I'll come and take me out of this place. So come and take me out of this place. Come take me out of this place. I'm on trash. I want to go back to my village. Let me go back to my village where they will not call me trash. They will not call me village scouts. I want to go Vico. Come and take me out of this place. Eh? Oh, they find farm men that are coming for my hand in marriage. Eh? Men that are ready to expect me, adore me. Men that won't call me trash. Or village scouts. Just because Auntie Carol convinced me, oh. That her brother does not have problem. Mbia here, mad now, born village stout. In village stout, I think I'm village stout. I want to go to my village, Obiko. Hey, and Karo should come and take me out of here. Adam, I know see. I won't marry again. Ha! This is our one day now. You will just kill me. Amount of talk. Is going to keep you here for the next 24 hours. You hear me? You are leaving my house today and that is final. What is wrong with you? You are supposed to be my wife for crying out loud. I make little corrections around this house. Things that I need you to do. What do you, you run to my sister to go and report me? In a yala? Are you crazy? Sister, she's leaving. And that is final. I see! Michael, she's not going anywhere. In any hand, I my oh, she's going somewhere. She is not going oh, sister, anywhere. she's going somewhere. She is going to your house. She is going to move in with you as her husband. That is what is going to happen. You fell out there, Megan. Are you not ashamed? How? For what? Eh? For what? In six months, only yes. see. Eh. You have married and separated with two women. I don't care. Do you know what people will say? What will they say? They will call you possessed. Yes, I am possessed, sister. Let it be said. That I am possessed. Hey. Let people who not know my story, who do not know my story, judge me. Let them feel it. I don't care. I don't care. This idiot, this shrew that you brought into my house has to live today. This girl is nothing but crisis and acrimony. She has to go. She, she has to go. She has to go. So because of that wayward and uncultured lady you married, <laughs> that is why you are trying this Decent and beautiful gift eh? of the wife I brought to What you have packaged for me is the wonderful devil. Look at her. Look at her eyes. She's trying to kill me. Hey. Short, she's trying to frustrate me. She has to go. She has to go. I can see you are still under the bondage of that man. Sister, you are under the bondage. Sister, you are, if I, both of you are under bondage. Both of you are That's why you're so friendly and glued together. You know what they say? Birds of a feather, they flock together. Both of you are flocking, but both of you will flock out of my house. Sister, enough is enough. Listen to me. Like I said, no amount of sermon will keep you here till dawn. You're leaving this house. Don't put that here again. Forget about that. Idiot. This is not happening. Devil, you are a liar. You can't succeed on this. Hey, Satan, Imam, Mamma, Imam, Mamma. I am that I am. Emperor of tribe of Judah. Ebekino. This cannot happen. Auntie Karo. Auntie Karo, please. He said we should leave. Let's just go, Biko. Go away. Eh? Let him listen to your brother. We're a problem. We're a problem. We're a problem. He has no problem. The devil is just trying to penetrate. And it will not be a trash. 
He called me a village stout. Forget about I, I, all I, I, the names. Please, please, please. Forget about all these names. <laughs> Cheers, mom. Cheers, my dear. <laughs> I can't thank you enough for your support during the fibroid operation. Mm. My dear, it's okay. I thank God for everything. Yes. Thank God the operation was successful. Thank God. <laughs> Honestly, Mom, I regret losing some suitors that came my way in the past. That's all right, my dear. God's time is the best. I know. I saw Ken the other day with a lady, and my heart sank. I know you really loved him. I do, Mom. I really do. That's alright. Sometimes God allows us to know the value of what is going to come our way. Mom, I now know the real value of a man in a woman's life. I'm happy you can now discuss this matter openly and honestly with me. Unlike in the past, I pray that God brings the right suitor your way soon. Amen, Mom. Amen. Amen. <laughs> and I will not dig into any suitor's past again. Of course, inquiries will be made, but they have to be reasonable. Every man coming your way is not a gold digger like your father wants you to believe. But you know, I don't agree with Dad on that, Mom. Ken is not a gold digger. No, of course it's not. Mm. I can't thank you enough for, for opening my eyes to a lot of realities, more than You're welcome, my darling. Mm. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Hey. Thank you. Oh, my dear. You're the best mom ever, thank ever, you. ever. <laughs> hey. Mm. You just press more. Go down more. Here. Yeah, I like it when you press it. You squeeze it, you know, rumble it. Now. Mm. Make it soft. Make it. <laughs> you love to be spoiled. Yeah, like a lot of it touched by you, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Mm, so sweet. Baby, mm. I want to ask you for a favor. Please don't say no. Okay. Please go ahead. I would like to give our village house a lift. Okay. My brother is very useless and doesn't care about us. I would like to renew it so that when you and your people come for my introduction, you won't be embarrassed. Hmm, that's nice. Well, that's a wonderful one. So, um, how much are we talking about here? Just three million naira. I mean, I can manage that. Three. Is something wrong? No, no, no. Oh. Um, it's okay, just give me some time. Okay? But baby, we don't have time. We don't have time. How? Baby, come on. You said you love me very much and you want to settle with me as soon as possible and vice versa. We are compatible. Not like that, your former girlfriend. Hey, 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 hey. Stop it. Just stop it. I don't like it when you make reference to Alaka. It's none of your business. Okay. I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry. Come on, baby. Don't be mad. You know you're the love of my life, right? Mm-hmm. You are. Come on here, don't be mad at me. Mm. Mm. I know you want it, so just have it. Mm. That's why I love you. Yeah? You know how to make a man happy. Not just the man, but the love of my life. <laughs> Take another. <laughs> so, when am I getting the money? I just told you to give me some time. Okay. My lord. 
and my master. My brother, you did the right thing. Yes. Anytime a woman becomes stubborn and, and, and disobedient, you throw her out. Simple. You are too young to, to, to develop high potential because of one, one, one village girl. No way. Ah, you did well. Thank you very much. You're welcome. You're welcome. That's why I came. Uh, so, but um, what about that matter that I discussed with you over the phone? The last... What matter? Remind me, please. The, the, the charity fund. I know I told you that we are reaching out to prominent personalities in this city to donate to the widow's charity fund so that we can alleviate the suffering of, of widows with some palliatives. You know, man, all these widows have suffered. Madoka, why is it that every time you come here it's about money? Me? Yes, you. No, no, it's not so. Oh, it is so. And I'll have you know that I do not have a dime to give to you. Not today, not tomorrow. And if our relationship cannot thrive on other basis, apart from personal aggrandizement, I'll suggest that we go our separate ways. Man, I know. Don't say that, my brother. We cannot, you and I separate. No, it's not possible. Oh, it is possible. How? Even people renounce their parents, tuckless of a king's man. It is very possible, Maduka. You are embarrassing your, your, your chairman. I'm not embarrassing you. As a matter of fact, I think you have overstayed your welcome. All of you conspired to bring that devil into my home. Please, get up and leave. No, oh, is that what is uh, annoying you? No, 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 I wasn't part of it. At all, at all. I had no hand in bringing that girl to your life. It was your sister. And I was telling her that she should leave you alone. Right. That you needed your space as a man to recover from uh, the other tragedy. Not to bring another tragedy on top of uh, the last tragedy. I see that. Just me. I totally understand that your side of the story sounds quite interesting. But leave. Please. Leave my house. You are actually chasing me. Out. I'm asking you to leave my house. So, the, the, the charity... Malika, please, take your phone and leave my house. Here. No, my, 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 you, you have changed. I have changed because I have become wiser. You hear me? Please. Get out. I am really surprised at your behavior. It's okay, let me go. Uh, Malika, I am five seconds away from pushing you out of my house. Man, don't worry. I will go. Maybe I will call you on Malika. phone later. Do not call my phone. I will not take your calls. Get out. When I want to call you, 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 come, you come and hold my hand. You come and hold my hand when I want to call you. No, 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 get it in here. Can you get it by you? Maduka, leave my house. You want to push your chairman out? Mike, don't do it. Let me live with dignity. And look at my house. I, don't I have a house? Bloody leech. We all have our flaws. Man is full of imperfection Life is deeper than what you think of Yes, life Pasha has reached your work home Ha-ha! So soon? Hey! I thought they said to take up to a year before she resumes hmm. work My sister, they have money to take her to the best hospital Hey! People like us, we'll just die. And we're the ones working for that money. Penny. Ah! Monkey, they walk about with a chop. <laughs> but one day, Monkey go go market. It will never return. <laughs> that is our prayer request. Mm. Come, let's come to the coffee. There are so many gist. Come. Oh, come. Ah. Hey. Then what you think of? God is not a man. God is not a man. He knows
You mean you tracked me down here to say this nonsense? No, young man, it's not nonsense. All right? Tina is still married to me legally. So technically, you, you don't have rights over her. Oh, God, stop talk. A woman that you abandoned on your wedding man, you are a wicked man. What are you even saying? Don't, don't be quick to judge me. You don't know what transpired. Please. What the hell transpired? Please. Wait, wait, what the hell transpired? You made her a laughing stock. She had to disguise to go out every time. Until I, Uche, came into her life. I was the man that she deserved. So, God, please step out and remain there. Please don't come here. Look, all I ask you is that you allow me to see her. Let me just have a word with her. Let, let me talk to her. I, I believe that if you allow me five minutes to speak to her, think my, things might change. Please, please. Allow you to see my wife. Oh, God, we are married, though. Sit, sit, during here. We are married. See, for that miserable bike price that you paid, our parents, our father and our mother, they will give it to you. Please go back there and meet them. That's all I want. See, for the divorce, you will get that in court. Please, Oga, get out from here. Get out from here, please. I'm telling you. Yeah, listen, listen. I beg you. Please, let me see her. All right, I'm, I'm willing to compensate for all that you've done for her. For all, for, for all that you have done for her. I can pay you back. Just, just name the figures, name the amount. I will pay you handsomely, please. Just allow me access to Tina. That's all I ask, please. Hey! hey, hey. You, all right? Hey! Just name the amount, name, name the figure. Will you shut up your mouth? Please. God, this idiot. Please. So, do I look like as if I'm hungry to you? I, I haven't said so. So, you are asking me to sell my wife to you? Oh, God, please, your answer don't do. But she's please. Still, she's still my wife. God, please, I'm telling you, my wife cannot be bought. And please, don't come and ridicule me with that nonsense that you're saying. I am begging you for the last time, respect yourself this minute and get out of here before I do something very, very bad to you. Oh, yeah. Take it easy, man. When you stay there, I'm not going to jam you, idiot. Idiot. Since four o'clock, and you're nowhere to be found. Calm down now, Joe. Eh? Calm down. Every time you'll be angry. Calm down. Sandra, if you don't tell me where you're coming from now, they'll bury two of us here this night. Joe, wait. You're always shouting, eh? See. What 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 what, what is that? Hundred thousand naira. Hundred from where? Uncle Mike gave it to me so that we use it and add to the money I want to use to start a business. Uncle Mike, the same Uncle Mike I know gave you 100,000. The same uncle that said that I'm nothing. That I am nothing, that I'm nobody to marry you. Don't worry, see that your uncle, I will show him this lifetime. I will, I will make money. Oh, Joe, just calm down. Eh, hey, calm down. You know that was then. That was then. He was angry with me, but you see now. We've settled our disputes. You know, blood is very thick. Blood is thicker than water. We've settled this. Uh, but that's not the reason why you you you, you off your phone. Uh, I've been calling you since. I'm sorry now. Uh, you know, there was no light to power power my phone, and you don't even have common small generator that I can use to charge my phone here. Uh, let me see the um, hundred thousand. Which money? 
Sandra, come, let me see more than me. Let me. I'm not giving anyone the money. Sandra, I'm not giving anyone the money. Sandra, I'm not giving anyone the money. Sandra, I'm not giving anyone the money. What is strong again? Mother, you will not eh? understand. You will not understand. I have never felt this humiliated in my life. Hi. What is it again? Mother, mother, just sit. Sit, please. Sit, sit. What is it again? Mom, you know Chima, right? Yes, that's your new friend. <laughs> he asked me out for a drink. When we got to our meeting point, he said he was expecting a friend. Guess who the friend is, mother? Guess who was it? Kennedy, mom. Kennedy. I, I looked so stupid before those two men. Mother, this has never happened before in my life. Amaka, it's okay. It's not okay, it's mother. Okay. It is not you cost it, mother. You caused it, mom. You were pushing me. Look at where it has landed me. No, they will be gossiping about me. They'll be gossiping about me. I let them say whatever they want. Hey, mom. They will be saying I keep jumping from one man to another. Mother, this is not okay. Mother, no, 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 I invited you over because I need to talk to someone. Okay. I've been dying in silence, Ken. I've been living with a lot of regret and a heartache, and I just think that it's it's time to not just talk about it but do the right thing. I know that what I'm about to say would sound crazy even to you, but you're my best friend in the world. And I think that you should know first. Kenny, I, I want Tina back as my wife. Tina, how do you mean? Exactly what I have just said. I want her back as my wife. Listen, man. Have I not tried? You know I have. This. But she's the only one that I love. Tina is the only woman that I've got chemistry with. She's the only one that makes me happy. Like I'm, a, I'm myself when I'm with her. Woman deeply. I want her back. But I need you. I need your help. That's really strange. After all that happened? Yeah, I know a lot happened, but you know. Thinking about it, Ken, I think that I might have overreacted that night. You know what they say, he who's without sin cast the first stone. You and I are not perfect either. But you know what? All that has passed. Moving forward. How do I win my woman back? I don't care what anybody says. I don't care what anyone thinks. How I feel should come first right now. I want her back as my wife. Okay, uh, assuming I even begin to understand you, what about her? What? How do you begin to look for her? Because I heard she traveled out of the country. Oh, no, 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 no. Tina is in this town. What are you talking about? I, I saw her a few days ago. She's in town. Yeah, she's in town. Tina is in town. She's in town with her new husband, some guy. Mm -hmm. New husband? Yeah, I also ran into the guy yesterday. Pulled him to a corner, tried to have a man to man conversation with him. I promised him heaven and earth just to allow me to reconcile with Tina. He refused. Kenny, I need your help. I can't fight and win this battle alone. I need you. Please. Uh, uh, the whole thing is even confusing to me. I don't even know how to yeah. begin to tackle this situation. I, yeah. it, 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 Tina is in town and... and, and has remarried. Yeah, to some guy that Whoa. I... Whoa. <laughs> you know? Listen, I, I know I can't 
take her from that guy. Yeah, I can. If you help me. Please, man, I need your help. Carol, I don't know what is wrong with our brother Michael. I did everything within my powers to convince him to take back uh, Esther as his wife. Chakam, he was adamant. He said, Guinea, lie, never. I said, what? He even chased me out of his house. Huh? Yeah. The same thing he did to me. Eh? I am telling you. He did it to you too? Hmm. This is not ordinary. At all, something is wrong. Village people are after my family. I suspect. They want to close my father's lineage. But the God I serve, the God that I serve, the Holy One of Israel will not allow them. He will cripple and shame them. Amen. Amen. Correct. Correct prayer. Correct prayer. Hmm. The devil is at work. The devil is a liar. So what, 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 what do we do now? What do we do? What about Esther? Her one. She's in the house. Eating my food and drinking my water. Hey. It has not been easy for me. Hey, I can imagine. But what can I do? Eh? Hmm. What do I do? You know my husband's condition. Obulunkiabia. Sancha Chabu de Gross. Oh, this must be heavy eh? burden on oh, you. Oh, Seni Guadaris. Hey, I pity you, Carol. So, um, have you contacted her people, Esther? Because the way the situation is, you need to let them know immediately. Maduka, huh? do I have the face and the mouth to tell them? What will I be telling them after all the assurance? Hey, this is very shameful. Oh, I pity you. Hey, this is not ordinary at all. My brother needs deliverance. I have arranged meetings with my prophet, but Michael refused to go. Why? He is very stubborn. The spirit of stubbornness has possessed Michael. I can see. And I must pray him out. I, I must pray him out. The way he chased me out today, I could not believe it. More. See, I'm on here. See, I'm going to go. See, I'm going to even ordinary color. He said, no color, no color, no color. No color. <laughs> Carol, um, I, was Hi. I was thinking, eh, um, since all this uh, prayer and fasting and everything, prophets, since they are not working, um, I was thinking I might take him to the village so that they will uh, uh, do a rag. for him. Is she a watcher? Is she a watcher? I was forbid. Heavens forbid. It's in the Bible. The Bible says, uh, give to God what is God, uh, give to Caesar what is Caesar. We are not of Caesar's. But it's Caesar in the Bible. We, we are not of Caesar's. Caesar is in the Bible. This is Caesar, Mwesa. Me and my family can never be Caesar's. Yeah. What are you saying? It's, I just want to say... Yeah, Maduka. Uh, yeah? Are you sure you are not serving two masters at a time? But more because... Maduka. Because the way you talk now shows that no, 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 I'm a stunt, no, I'm a stunt Christian. And you are talking about practicing hidden. It's not hidden, it's, 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 so why do you want to drag my brother into paganism? I want to help him. You want him to worship idol no, by I, helping him. I want May to... heavens forgive you. Mama. I want to make heaven. Have you seen heaven before? At times, if, if I heaven. sit, eh? if, go heaven. If, if I sit at times after midnight prayers and meditate, Obunyem, if you go to heaven, you will see the angels. Singing hallelujah, hosanna to Christ. Everywhere is white. There is nothing like morning, afternoon or evening. Nobody is hungry there. That's why the Bible says that in my father's house, everything is complete. Let 
many mansions. Many mansions are there, and you want to drag my brother to Pegani no, 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 so no, that no, he no, will no, no, not make heaven. No. If I am going to heaven, I am dragging all my family to heaven, and we must make heaven. Me too. Including my girl, my brother. No, me too. Meet her. Me. Hey! Me it's, it's not the way you're looking at it. I want what? solution. That's all. Which solution? Don't even go there. The Bible condemns hidden worshipping. I run a walk, a baby. Don't. It is not pagans. It, hey, it, it is. It is. It is. It is. It is. Have you seen Sandra? I came back to the house. It's four o'clock. This girl is nowhere. Her number is not even going. What kind of statement is that? Which one is her money? What kind of why, how am I monitoring her? Is she not my wife? Is she not my wife? Can't I? Please, I don't like the way you talk sometimes. I've heard. I've, I have heard. It's okay. I'm the one, it's okay. I will not I will not bother you. Don't worry, I've heard. Thank you. It's okay. This girl, if you come back, if you enter this house today. If you enter this house today, I'll show you this. Just come back to this house today. Hey, baby. Mm -hmm. Did I tell you what happened to me last night? Mm -mm. <laughs> what happened? I had a terrible dream mm. in which Tina was chasing me with a machet. Tina? Yes. The same Tina you know. Mike's former stupid wife. Really? Why? How would I know? I had to wake up and pursue her with Holy Ghost fire. Hmm. That's strange. Very strange. You know, that girl can be very evil and fetish. Fetish? Yes, very fetish. <laughs> As a matter of fact, it was Juju she used and hold your friend, Mike. As soon as it cleared up, he got back to his senses. Hmm. <laughs> Girls can be so I, 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 Are you sure of what you're saying? Of course. I am a girl and I'm telling you what babes do nowadays. Here you are asking me if I'm sure. Oh. Oh. Wait. So you do the same thing? Kennedy! What kind of question is that? I mean, how can you even ask me such a thing? Because he said you're sure that that's what babes do and you're a babe. You know what? Let's just drop the topic. Let's just drop it. Ha! Huh. I can't even have a conversation with you as my man. Because you twist things for no apparent reason. It's not a problem at all. I can make the trip if we, if we agree on terms. Yes. Oh no, he called me yesterday and then told me that um, um, an email was sent to him. No, 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 no. A few things were just uh, specified in the meeting and, uh, and then we were told that we'll... That they would revert and that we'll take it from there. Yes. Please, I, I'm so, so sorry. If you don't mind, can I call you back? Bye. Hey, Kenny. What's up? Good man. What? Are you serious? Dead serious. Sure what you've just told me. 
I'm very sure. Oh. <laughs> what do I do now? What do I do? It's in your hands. The ball is in your court. Because you're not going to kidnap you are. me. No, 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 please. Tina, please. Calm down. I'm sorry. I just want to talk to you. All right? Just let me get a word in, please. Mike, take me back to my husband. And you, go back to your wife. Come, calm down. Please, calm down. Listen, that young man is not your husband. I know he's not your husband. You're not married yet. Calm down. Listen, he's Uche, your cousin, right? The one who couldn't make it to our wedding. Please, just let me talk to you. How did you? So that when you love someone, you find a way. Right. I, I did my investigations and I found out that he's not your husband. So, what about your new wife? I don't have a wife. Liar! I have no wife. I, I, there's no one in my house. Trust me. Liar! Liar! I saw you both with my own eyes. If you, if you come to the house and you find a woman there, then I'd let you go. Mike, I'm not going anyway. I'd let you go forever. I promise you. Mike, I'm not going anywhere. Please, I beg you. Wait a minute, I am not going anywhere. I you just hear me. For all time's sake, for the way that we've loved each other over time, please, for the way that I know that you still feel about me, please just hear me out. Please. I beg you. Please. Just, just get in the car, please. Please.
the meaning of this? What's going on? Um, I just want you back home, please. This is your home. Uh, please. If you just come in with me, I would explain. Please. Please. Life was hard and empty without you. It was really hard without you. Mine was worse. Everybody rejected me. I even tried committing suicide. What? But it didn't work. I managed to survive living in disguise until the day you busted me. Yeah. Then my cousin came back from the UK and then he gave me a little hope. I'm sorry. Everything that you went through was my fault. Sorry. No, it wasn't your fault. It was. No, it wasn't. Any man in your position would have reacted the same way. Mike, so what's going to happen now? I'm confused. Why are you confused? I loved you at first sight. And I love you even more now, at second sight. You remain my wife, baby. I love you. I love you so much. I can know. My story is everywhere. People know about me. They say, what will your friends say? What will your family say? I don't care. I don't care what anyone says. What I care about is how we feel. I love you. I have paid so dearly for my indiscretions, and it won't happen again now. You're here now with me, and that's all that matters. Don't you want me anymore? Look at me. Are you loving someone else? Is there someone else in the picture? Life was hard without you. And I'm not walking that lonely road again. I just want you here with me forever. And give us another chance, baby. I miss you. My life is empty without you. In it. Please. Please, baby.
Good morning, man. Good morning, baby. Did you sleep well? Mm-hmm. I did. I need to go. Go away. Hey, go away. You're not okay. You can't leave. Please don't go, please. I want you here. Okay? I want you here. If you want something, I can I can get it for you. Whatever it is you want, I I can. Even if you have to go to your place to get something that you really, really need, we can go together. That way I will let you out of my sight. Please don't go. Please. Yeah. And I think you should make us breakfast, really, you know? I mean, we just woke up. Why are you talking about leaving now? Huh? Come on now, make us breakfast. Huh? Just like old times. Please. Mm -hmm. Tell me you stay. Tell me you stay. You will? Mm -hmm. Will you stay? So, you have not heard. Heard what? Who died? Nobody died, but uh, what has happened is <laughs> it's just as terrible. It's just as terrible as somebody died. Tell me now. What happened? It is too heavy in my mouth to even say it. Monica, say it. That Obanje girl has come back to your brother's house. That is what happened. Onye? Who came back? Tina! Or whatever you call her. The one that nearly killed our brother. Came back where? To Mike's house. She came back to Mike's house. Maruka, you are joking. Joking, what? You are joking. How can I joke with such a, a such a serious matter? Tina has come back. Who told you this? Clement, the get man. He called me and said Mike brought her back by himself yesterday. He said when they when they when they drove into the house and came down that Mike was holding her like this. He was like this, and they were doing, he was kissing her, and they entered the house. Hey! King of glory! How can you allow my own brother to commit such sacrilege? King of glory, why? I am that I am, why? Ancient of days, why? You said that those that trusted in you are like Mountain Zion. They shall never be removed from their path. Yeah. Why do you want my brother to go astray? Uh, uh, Carol, Carol, because, uh, um, please, I'm going late for a meeting. You know, I'm the chairman. I just say, let me give you this information. But please, uh, do not say I told you. Uh, just say you heard it the same way I heard it. You understand? This is not happening. Uh, uh, you can't, please check, check. check and get this back is to not true. Check and get back to father, me. you will not allow this to happen. You cannot shame me, Father. Nebico, you cannot me. shame me, ancient of days. You cannot. King of glory, you cannot let this happen to me. I am that I am. Ever of tribe of Judea, the Ahala Ashei Aholi. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man. God is not a man, he knows more than you do. Hello sister, good morning. What did you hear? Um, sister, first off, I want to know who told you and, and how is it that person's business? Sister, it's early in the day. I cannot do this right now. I'll have to call you later in the day. Right. Breakfast is ready. Hey, baby. Thank you very much. And no one can say to have become one. Oh, oh, and no one can separate. You know, I could 
stanęła ci łody. Sister, good morning. Mm, hold your peace. Who is your sister? Hey, Michael, the Holy Spirit cannot allow me to be sister to a lost soul. A man who cannot be man enough. A man who can stoop so low to eat his own vomit. Yeah! It's a sacrilege. So what is it? Where is that uncircumcised and wayward girl? Where is she? I have come to chase her away. Her juju must have hypnotized you. But it can never touch me. Never! Because I am the child of the Most High God. Where is she? A back one more. I'm sister. First off, you're shouting. Huh? I don't like it. Secondly, and most importantly, you will not describe my wife in that manner with such language. Stop it. Holy Spirit. Wife. Wow. Yes. Huh? Sister, sister, Tina is my wife. That's our reality now. I don't care what anybody thinks. That girl loves me. And I love her with all of my heart. Sister, we have tried. Oh, she's tried with a couple of other people. I have tried with people as well. It did not work. But luckily for us, God, in his infinite mercies, gave us a second chance to make this work. And we're doing the best that we can at it. So please, don't bring bad energy to this. No. It is the devil she worships that has brought her back to finish you up. Michael Mepanyage, receive wisdom, receive sense, Michael. Oh, God of mercy, have mercy on my soul and save my brother from this bondage. I, I am that I am. You said they will gather, but they will scatter in seven folds. Sister. Because their gathering is not of you. I'm not in bondage. Huh? Oh, I am not, I'm not in bondage. You are my brother. No, I am not in bondage. I love my wife. As you can see, I am very comfortable and happy. <laughs> Michael Wendem, you are not happy. I am happy. No. I am very no. happy. No. You are not happy. The devil is using that girl to frustrate your life. You are not. Hey. Sister. Sister. Hear me now and hear me well. It is Christians like you that make the devil more relevant than he already is. Christians like you make the devil look busier than he naturally is. Sister. This has nothing to do with the devil. This has everything to do with your myopic view to life. Hmm. Leave my wife alone. Hey. It's early in the day. I'm not going to start my day with this kind of drama. We can talk about this some other time. My if bro. I feel it's necessary. My but for bro. now, Pico, can you all? We can talk about it some other time. Mike. If I feel like it. Michael, when the devil wants to use somebody, or will you vote in your no, no, if you are asking me out of your house, if I get made you what? Michael, if I get maybe one, if I get me. the devil is trying to penetrate into your life and I will not allow it to happen. You uncircumcised human being, where are you? From the pit of hell! Hey, hey, they enter, they enter. They enter. Yes, sir! Come on, come on, nice game. Nice game. Hey, this is good. Hey. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey! Hey, hey! Hey! Tottenham! 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 How can you even want to go draw this game? Hey! How good is this 23 million? Oh, God. Hey! The last 10,000. Nah, this game will kill me today. The last 10,000 in this house. Hey! Nah, this game not up here. This is the better song. You know, 
so the design from this is less okay, okay. okay that's true that's true mm -hmm. Respect for experience. My friend, I will give this to my uncle. He said by the ending of the month, we'll go for an interview. And those selected will be given the job immediately. Ah, that is a wonderful news. Mm. I already told him about yourself. He said we should not even be bothered. That the interview will be mere formality. So don't worry. Eh? In one more time, we'll leave this nonsense company and work in a better place. Don't mm. worry. I can't wait. I can't wait to leave this useless place. Mm. My sister, thank you. God bless you. What are friends for? Ah, hey, Sherry. Ah. Ah. Like, let me go to my office before that winch of a girl will begin to talk more. We'll see time. later. It's a matter of time. Ah. We'll shop them. Mm. We'll see you later, yeah? Thank you. Please sign here. Mrs. Adekunle, after several oral warnings and appeals on your laxity at work, nothing has changed. As stated here, you have 12 working hours to reply to this query. You can go now. Wobi, since you came to this office, I've been your target. <laughs> I don't blame you. Ah, <laughs> If you were married and have children, you will know what it means to raise children and work at the same time. <laughs> You're jealous of me. Oh, my jealousy. Are you talking to me like that? Are you? Who are you? Who are you? Mm -hmm. Are you? Hmm. Am I the one that has stopped you from getting married? Eh? Which man wants to live with a bad character? Hmm. I am not working again. Hmm. Eat your job. Eat your father's work. I am not working again. Nonsense. Look at her mouth. Why is your face like this? What happened? She sent for me. About what now? I thought she had something important to tell me. Only for her to give me query. Query? For what? I don't know. That I'm not serious with my work. Blah, blah, blah. Ah, nonsense. So what did you do? Amy. I told him. Pepper in her face. Let her eat her father's work. Good. So what are you going to do now? I am going to collect my last salary and go. I am not working again. Ha. That's my friend. Correct girl. There's nothing like being free. Hmm. My sister, I will come to your house later. Thank you. Oh. Don't mind that that nonsense girl. Ha. My friend, take it easy. Oh. Hey, babe. Hey, guess honey. Guess what? Guess what? I've got good news for you. Mm. Wonderful news. Um, so, guess. Um, you're finally going to buy my iPhone. No? You're renovating my family house. None of that. Just guess. Try. 
I can't guess then. Okay, I'm going to tell you. Tina is back. Tina? Yeah. Who is Tina? The same Tina that you know. The one you were her maid of honor. What? Yeah. Tina came back to this town? Well, not only that she came back, she came back with her husband. Mike did not throw her out. Well, why would Mike do a thing like that? Why wouldn't he? I, I thought you were supposed to be happy for her return. Why would I be happy for her? I mean, she's going to fortify her charms and he's falling for her again. What? Why are you talking about your fellow woman in such manner? Kennedy. What has she done to you? Kennedy, are you by any means implying you can live with a former prostitute? My dear, are you holier than her? Are you? No, be honest. Kennedy. This is very rude and disrespectful to my personality. How dare you compare me to that slut? Nobody holy pass. Hmm? Anyway, Mike invited me for a dinner in their house. So I'm going to honor the invitation. What? Mm -hmm. Suit yourself. But I will not be a part of it. As a matter of fact, come and drop me. Wait, 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 wait. Let me ask you something. Why are you so paranoid when it comes to some things concerning Tina? Why? Because she's a prostitute and I'm too decent to mingle with her. Uh, I ask you, are you holier than her? Be honest. <clears throat> are you? Kennedy! You? You're looking good though. Ah, my sister. See me now. <laughs> hey. oh. Ah, Bao. Hmm? Ah, beg, when are you going to resign from that useless company? Resign. I'm not resigning now. Uh uh. Kilo Shelly. What happened? Mm -hmm. I thought you already wrote your resignation later. Huh? Mm -hmm. And your uncle will give us another job. Oh, that thing. It did not work out too. Ah. That my uncle is a very useless man. A very useless man. The only thing he knows how to do is to send us useless messages. And when it's time to help us, he, he gives us flimsy excuses. I don't understand you. Ah. Are you telling me that you still work in that, in that useless place? Why not? Huh. My friend, a bed in hand is better than a thousand in a bush. Ha! Ah. Why did you deceive me? Let me see Wahala. How did I deceive you? Was I the one that told you to go and quarrel with the MD's daughter? Koyo. Ah, please, oh. Why are you talking like this? <sighs> How am I talking, my friend? When you the one that said you wanted to resign, so you start a new <sighs> business. What is my concern? If you resign, how does it concern me? Koyo. I thought we were in this together. Eh, please, 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 oh. Carry your problems on your head. <sighs> Carry it. Carry your problems on your head. Your business is your business. My business is my business. So please. Call your... Ah, you're a bad person. Ah, you're a bad job. Call your... You're a bloody betrayer. What did I do? Ah. Oh, was I the one that told you to quarrel with the MD's daughter? Ah. See me see problem. Ah. Hey. See me see wahala. Ah. Hey. Call your... You have lost ah, you don't go better for you. Oh, no, Bruku. Ah, where is it? Ah, you deceive me like this. Ah, ah. Uh, who is that, you? Madam Gora. Uh, Madam God, please wait for me. For what? Clement, huh? what is it? Auntie Karu, mm -hmm. please don't tell Oga that I, Clement, opened this gate for you. Eh? Because
Because as I'm seeing Oga, Oga is ready to give me a red card. My friend, relax. He's ready to sack me. Relax. Nothing is going to happen to you. I also own this house. Huh? Uh -huh. Do you know what I suffered to train Michael when our parents died? Oh, you suffered for him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, whoa, whoa. I suffered and suffered and suffered and by the power and the help of the Holy Spirit, he became successful. And now one riffraff from the coven of demons wants to reap where she did not sow. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, man. Uh -huh. oh, man, man. Auntie Carol, Auntie Carol, please. From the look of things, eh? it is obvious that Michael doesn't like me. He will eh? like you by force. Okay, I like it by. He will like you by fire by force. I can't, I can't, I can't. You see, you see, you see this mummy water, eh? This mummy water yoke. We must break it on him. The man of God said that only your physical appearance can do it. Mm. So when he comes back, mm. all you need to do is to greet him as your loving husband. Mm -hmm. If I'm a bit. Mm. Trust me when I say that. But he doesn't love me, eh? And nothing will change it. Who's fed? I'm not comfortable here. Who's fed? He loves you very well. Mm -hmm. It is that witch of a girl that she brought that didn't allow him to see anything good in you. Now the pastor has given me the revelation. Mm -hmm. All we need to do is to pray. You should be meditating. You need to go and sit down and meditate. Uh? Hey! Remember in the scripture they said, surely they will gather. But because their gathering is not of God, they will scatter in seven folds. Mm. My dear, Omoro can you get see Mulanya? Eh? Equen sue man you mugu fall or guy walk. It will not happen. Oh, yeah, Carry your bag, let's go. Uh -huh. You see, you are the wife we know. Uh -huh. Let one devil from the pit of hell open up there for a go. I, I, I will carry it inside. Once we get there, sit down and start meditating. I am supporting you. Hundred percent loss. You have to go for seeing where I am. What is that devil? Life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man. God is not a man. He knows more than you do. Life is deep. Be bold. Hmm? Very bold. Let us go to Psalm 108. A prayer for help against enemies. Hmm? We have complete confidence, oh God, in you. We will sing and praise you. We will wake up the song. We will wake up all the lyrics in us. He's back. Yes, and keep meditating. Keep I'm meditating. Bold. Keep meditating. Meditate. Consult the Holy Spirit. I hope there is no other one beside you. And I know at this point, this Going to take place will break all principalities and powers of any kind, whichever way they have gathered. Oh, yeah, get up. Go and welcome your husband. <laughs> oh, my loving husband. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I can kiss very well now. I have changed. Everything you complained about, I've learned how to do them. <laughs> I'm sure your eyes have cleared now. Auntie Carol, his eyes have cleared. The juju has left you. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My brother is back. <laughs> yes. Oh, my darling husband. <laughs> Take him inside as your loving husband. Oh, let's go inside the mama. Think more. Clement. Yeah, okay. Take this nonsense thing out of here. Okay. Stand here. Clement, I remember that I gave specific instructions. I need you to explain to me how these people got into my house. Oga, okay, I don't know. I don't know. What, you don't know? Yes, sir. Um, no, no, sir. Yes, sir. Um, sorry, sir. Uh, uh, is Auntie Caro... Uh, Auntie Caro said that uh, she also owned this house. 
including everything that is inside. In fact, she told me that uh, she saw the, all her clothes include pants and bra. What nonsense are you talking about? To train you in school after your parents died. Are you out of your mind? No, sir. It's because of the story that I heard. I decided to pity on her, sir. That nothingness. I shall deal with you later. No, sir. Uh, Clement. Huh? Out. Is it not what? Is that what you told him, sister? Is that what you tell people about me? Well, thank you very much for caring for me. Thank you for being there for me when our parents died. Thank you very much. As much as you were showing all of that care with pain, anger and aggression. Thank you, Steer. But sister, I have paid you now. But I have paid you back now, sister. I have paid you back. I have shown you so much love and kindness over the years. I put a roof over your head. A roof under which you and your ailing husband rest your head every night. I take care of your children. I pay their school fees. I put clothes on your back. I put your monthly salary. Your husband is down with stroke. The love I have for you, I transfer to him. I show empathy, I show love, I take care of him. What else do you want me to do? Since I have given you everything except one thing, control over me and my life and all that matters with me. Sister, that I'm sorry I cannot give. I cannot give. Stay out of my life. I will not let you control me like I'm some little boy. Sister, stay the hell out of my life. You see this village rat that you brought here, that you tried to foist on me, will not happen. Ask her. I never touched her for one day. She can confirm it. Did she also tell you that I gave her money as compensation so that she can start something for herself and stop jumping on the next rich guy that she sees? Sister, I have found love in Tina. She's my wife. And no one would change my mind. Not even you. Please, I beg you, stay away from me. I was not expecting to come back home and deal with this drama. Please, I'd advise that you take this thing out of my house before I call the police. Oh, hey! Police! Not only police. I should call the police. Call the army. Call the navy. Call SARS. We are not going anywhere. You see here, Anye Wunye Goka, soldiers of Christ. We are not going. Sister, you leave my house. The Holy Spirit reveals to me that this thing here, from the pit of hell, is not your wife. She is my wife. She is your wife. And you must marry her. Is that so? Come and sit down. Go and call the army. I am waiting. On your call police. Call the army. Call police. Sister, you're going to push me to embarrass you. Mm -hmm. Yes, hello? You devil, you are a liar. You what? cannot. What? You see this battle? We are going to win it by his grace. Oh, yeah. Of course. Of course. <laughs> Agaracha. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go! And you, Michael Agaracha. You come back and meet me. I am not going anywhere. The Holy Spirit I serve will not allow my brother to come back with you. And Sikaru, on my cash on one. Sopido. If it is for Sopido, we will learn how to wear Sopido. We must win this battle. Let's read this thing down. And it says, From the sanctuary God has said, In triumph I will devise Sheshum, and distribute the valley of Shoku to my people. Gilad is my Amenesha too. Ephraim is my helmet and Judah my royal sacred. But I will use Moab as my wash basin. Chineke, Geji, this idiot Obanje as wash basin in this house. Oh no, she's leaving. Uh, please, I job. Uh, I just, uh, uh, please, give me back my job. I just, uh, uh. You know how much I've contributed to this company? Please, uh, please give me back my job. I promise I will not do such thing again. I promise. Uh, I just, uh, I just. 
tools. Mrs. Adekunle. Sir, sir. When you started this work, you were good. But all of a sudden, you derailed. I tolerated you. Sir, it's not me. No. It's your daughter that caused it. Uh, we never had any problem until she came. Will you shut up? You want to pitch me against my only daughter? Ah, uh, no, sir, no. Uh, that shows how wicked you are. You're a wicked woman. No, sir, I'm not trying to do any such thing, no. Ah, uh, I'm not trying to do any such thing, sir. Will you shut up, you ingrate? What happened was all your fault, but I merely tolerated that. I accommodated you. Until my daughter came back to resume work in the company. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sir. It will happen again. For the past two years, you have transferred all your problems to the company. Your divorce case, your case with the landlord, the schooling of your children, and all what not. But I accommodated that. I did. What did you give me in return? Nothing. You become a rebel. Uh, gossiping with the name of the company and that of my daughter. Ah, uh, sir. I am not gossiping. Ah, uh, I'm not gossiping. It's in Koyo that are trying to lure me into, into gossiping. I'm not gossiping. Now will you leave my presence before I lose my time? Uh, leave my house now. Am I talking like somebody has water in his mouth? The devil I said me. leave. Sorry, sir. It's your sir. It's not Get happening. Get out again. of my sight now. You ingrate. <laughs> Get out before I throw you out. Before I get the security to get out of this place. Leave. I'm sorry, sir. All of you, gold diggers, opportunists. I say, get out of my presence before I become the devil myself. Leave. Okay, sir. You had all the opportunity to mend your life and you're messing up. Nonsense. Hypocrites. Imagine this bloody scallywag. Want to urinate on my intelligence. Come and walk. If we finish this food, you will cook another delicious food. The one that is more delicious than this one. Mm? <laughs> this is what that idiot came back to enjoy. <laughs> but the Holy Spirit we serve will keep crippling her. Hey! <clears throat> drink, drink, drink. <clears throat> huh? Hey! Hey, my girl, my name. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Him about. 
because he's carrying you like his handbag. Demon. <laughs> I'm really, really very sorry. Joseph, you won't feed me, yet you won't allow me work. You won't allow me to do business, and you won't allow me to have peace of mind. Sandra, you know if you leave me, I don't have anybody in my life. My parents are not with me. My bro nobody called. It's only you that I have. If you leave me, Sandra, you know I'll kill myself. Joseph, you're a bloody liar. You are a blood. You think you can continue deceiving? You, you think you can keep on deceiving me with this thing called love? You think you, you, you think you can keep on deceiving me with love and allow me to permit me to live in this wretched house? Sandra, I know how you feel. I know. I'm this will never happen again. Please, I'm just begging you. Carry the bag and go inside. Joseph, I'm not going inside. You cannot leave by this time now. Or I wait at least tomorrow morning. Wait till tomorrow morning. Joseph, Please. No, Joseph. No. I've made up my mind and it's fine now. I'm going back to Uncle Mike's house. Can you be saying Uncle Mike's house? I'm sorry now. It, it is marriage. If I do something wrong, you forgive me. Oh, Sandra, be please. And I'm going to apologize to him for disobeying him. The greatest, the greatest mistake I made was not listening to him. I'm going back there. Sandra, you know I don't have anybody in my life but you. If you leave me, I will kill myself. I have nothing else I'm doing. Please, I'm very sorry. What are you waiting for? Go inside and kill yourself now. Am I holding you? I've made up my mind. Don't follow me, Joseph. Don't follow me. Don't follow me. Sandra, wait now. Please. Eh? Sandra. I pray to you, God. Don't remain silent. Wicked and liars have attacked me and my brother. Father, do some corrupt judge to judge my enemies. Let no one of his own enemies accuse him. May he be tried and found guilty. May all his descendants die. Yes. And say, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Cook what you want to eat. This is your house. So on it up. I didn't see anything to cook. Meaning what? What do you mean you didn't see anything to cook in my brother's house? It's not possible. Everywhere is locked. Kitchen, store, even the drawers. He locked everywhere. What do you mean everywhere is locked? It's everywhere is locked. He locked everywhere. Even where he used to keep the noodles we eat. He locked that place too. Eh? Hey! Hey! It's you. Michael. So, this is your new tactic. Locking up everywhere so that Mumabu Caroline will start in my own brother's house. Hey! God of everything. God of Meshach, Shadrach, and Abadinego. I am that I am. Ember of tribe of Judea. The Akola, Ashai, Aholo. Papa Ketchuk, what is it? I am in my brother's house. I told you there's a problem I am settling. Okay, now you know. What else do you want me to tell you? I am not coming back today. I will stay till I see the end of this. Don't you know the way to the kitchen? Papa Okechuku, I am not coming back today. Tell Nkechi to boil yam for you to eat. But what else do you want me to do? Odima, since you can't get up to do anything, read your Bible. Be in the spirit, meditate, pray. Pray and pray hard, then the hunger will leave you. Yes! Be doing that until I'm back. Uh, uh, 
Be content to stop me. What is this? So, Auntie, what do I eat now? Go and see my family. Things are spoiling there. Okay. I want to leave me alone here. Nanya? Nanya, 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 nanya. Have I not tried for you? Eh? Esther? Since yesterday, I am here fighting for you. Can't you fight for yourself? Only name to do. Can't you fight for what belongs to you? Auntie, I can't stay here without you. He doesn't want to see me. If you go, I will follow you. Look at him. Anum Pama. Auntie, I cannot stay in this house without you. If you leave, I will follow you. Let me come. Am I the one looking for husband? Haven't I tried for you? You cannot fight your own fight. Eh? Auntie, why are you sounding like this? What have I done? This was not our agreement, though. If I have a fiber, this was not what we discussed, though. You will not leave me here. Is you, is you, is you, Eh? Don't you read your Bible anymore? Don't you study your Bible anymore? The kingdom of heaven suffered violence. And only the violence take it by force. What are you waiting? What are you waiting for? Conquer and occupy. Have you forgotten Esther in the Bible? She made herself the Esther of her generation. So make here your generation. Be the generation of this house. Look at what you're doing to yourself. Eh? Mugu fall. Guy walk. Let me not see you in my house. I'm going with you. Try it. Let me see you in my house. The heavens I says, eh, will cripple you. Only God's fire will nail you down. Auntie, oh. what is the matter? Organ yeah, Clement. Eh? I will call you later. Ah. Open the door. You have to take it easy. God is not a man. God is not a man. He knows more than you do. God is not a man. God is not a man, he knows more than you do. Uh, Akanyo, Akanyo, what is this? What was this guy? Uh, I should open it. What was this guy? I should open it. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. There is original fire on the mountain. Okay, I'm going to go. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than... Listen, please go and dress up. Let me go and drop you. Drop me? Yes. But I'm not ready to go yet. No, I want you to go. Please. Come on, Ken. Is it because of that small argument we had mm -mm, a while back? Mm -mm, not at all. Not at all. You've been here for the whole one week. I need some space. Space for what? Kennedy, are you cheating on me with another woman? 
I thought you said it's over between you and that Amaka girl. Ngozi, please go dress up. Let me drop you off. Huh? I, when I need you, I'm going to give you a call. And please, do not barge in on me. Okay? Without calling me on the phone. Because you will not be welcome. Ken. Let's go. But Ken, you said you're coming to see my people next month. But next month isn't here, is it? Ken, why are you doing this to me? Please, is this how you want to use and uh, dump me? Uh, um, good, please, go. Change. Go dress up. Let me go and drop you off. I have a meeting to meet up with. Please. Can good. Can you can you go dress up, please? I need some space. Come on, come on, come on, go. Please be fast. Your sister is here. She's here with somebody I don't know. She's cursing. She's shouting. Please. You need to come back. Now she's calling my name. She's calling your name. Please, just hurry back. Because I don't know what to do. Okay. Please, I'm waiting. Nonsense. No, this all of this has to stop, right? Just let me handle this, okay? Please. Please. Okay?
see here, you will not be alive to regret it. Get out of my house. Go back. Go back to your houses and solve your personal problems. Get out. Out. This woman right here is my wife. Legally married to me, she is in her house. Go to your homes. Go to your houses and solve your problems. Michael. So you are chasing me out of your house because of this wayward. Cast the first stone, Caroline, if you're innocent. Caroline, you claim to be a Christian, but your heart is full of darkness. Tell me, Caroline, is your home perfect? Is your life perfect, Caroline? How many times have I come to your home to settle disputes between you and your husband? How many times have I had to come there? To make peace that you lack in your heart. Is it not because of your bad character and infidelity that your husband dropped down with stroke at the age of 55? Because you lack peace and love in your heart. Leave me alone. Leave my wife alone. Michael. Are you accusing me? I'm not accusing you. I am telling you who you are. You constantly accuse others when you are full of iniquity. You claim to be in Christ, Caroline, but your life is in crisis. You're angry and bitter with me because I refuse to marry the she-devil that you brought into my house. <laughs> you know what they say? Always, birds of a feather flock together. Leave my home and never return. I do not ever want to see you again here. You sanctimonious hypocrite. Leave my house! Leave my house! Please, Waka. Forgive them! I've had just about enough of them. Clement. Sir? Your time here is up. This will cover for two months of your salary. Get your things together and get out of it. I've just about enough of your nonsense. Please, sir, please. Please, what's your story? Now, what's your story? Because of your sister, I make her open the gate, sir. Please. You must really think that I am stupid. You must really think that I don't know that you have been conspiring with my sister to fight my wife. Hi, hi. You had the mind to call my sister to tell her that my wife is here. Hi. Clement, what is your business with my life? Hi. Hi. Oh God, please forgive me. Oh. Go in there. Pack your things and leave. Forgive me, Madame Bacon. If you as much as address my wife one more time, I'll put it. Get in there, pack your things and get out of my house. If I come out here and you're still here, Clement, you are sure that I will shoot you. Idiot. My wife is pregnant. This nine months pregnant. My grandmother is sick. Who will take care of them? Oh God, you come. Not a man, God is not a man, he knows more than you do. Life is deeper than what you think of. Yes, life is deeper than what you think of. God is not a man, God is not a man. Baby, mm? you've been on your phone all day. Mm. You act like I'm invisible or 
Am I not beautiful enough to get all your attention to myself? <laughs> yeah, you're beautiful. Just that. Okay. You look like the queen of Sheba. Are you happy now? Baby. Mm -hmm. What really is going on? You changed. Changed? Yes. How? Ever since that Sina girl got back to your friend's house, everything just changed. Maybe her did you cut me? Baby, be serious. There's a connection between her coming back and your sudden attitude towards me. Mm -hmm. I don't really know what you're talking about. Please, don't, don't pretend. I know what is going on. What? Anyway. I know she told you I posted her wedding disaster on social media and it went viral. Yes, I did. I'm also sure she told you how she gave me her ATM card to help her withdraw some money, which I never did. And so what? Am I the only one who didn't want to associate with her after the incident? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do you know that this is just the first time I'm hearing all this? Yeah. You did all that? You did all that to your friend? You flatmate? Someone that you were uh, a maid of honor? Oh, come on and go see. That's bad. That's treachery and, 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 and sheer wickedness. Baby, it's not like that. The whole thing was like a big shock to me. I mean, think about it. Even Mike, who claimed to love her so much, couldn't stand it. What more of me, who was just her friend? And what of all the lies and fabrications you lead against her? Were they shot to you too? Oh, Gussie. Do you know what? You're just bad. You, you have a very bad heart. You're not good at all. Anyway, whatever you think I am, I would never be a prostitute. But it can be a betrayer. A liar, a thief, and a potential killer. Jesus Christ! King! Hmm? What has come over you? How can you address me like that? Hmm? Okay, hold on. Take a look. No. Take a look. Go on, take it. Mm -hmm. Abigail, the love gum works like mad. Yes! As I speak to you, I have him right here. Mm -hmm. Whatever I say is what he does. Oh yes! Babe! This woman is too much. Look at me, Ngozi. Before I'll be looking for rich men and love up and down. But these days, I don't even bother Chacha. Anything I tell Kennedy to do, be it money, be it love, I don't even bother. Yes! Hey, now, if you know what is good for you, better go and meet that woman and collect your own love gum before another person will come and collect your boyfriend from you. Yes! Even if you don't have the money, nay, go and borrow. You will thank me later. It's just a one-time thing. Before you know it, you'll get pregnant. You'll give birth. It's yours forever. Or is Woku. Yes! <laughs> I know. Elena, I don't want to shout because he might hear me. In fact, I have to end this call now. Yes! <laughs> okay, I'll call you later. No, 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 no. Don't give me updates when I'm still here. I'll call you to know how it went, yeah? Oh, Abigail. Okay. Hello, babe. I'll call you back. Yes, let me go and see. Baby! Babe! Um, no, um, 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 I, 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 I,
Maybe I can explain. I, I... Maybe I can... things, including your children, and leave my house now. <laughs> Go and pack your things, leave my house, I also leave my life now. Um, are you going my way? I could um, give you a lift. No. I'm not going your direction. I'm actually going this way. Mm. How is our house? Excuse me. Ngozi, you and who? You actually told everybody that I was squatting with you, right? So? And you know very well that I paid for that apartment. Tina. That is my apartment. You were about to be thrown out of that apartment when I came into town. And I paid for the entire one year rent. Okay. So what? What did I ever do to you? What did I do to incur such hatred from you? Mm, 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 mm. Tina, I am not in the mood for all this kind of talk. I see you are back to your marriage. Good for you. Can you leave me alone then? Please. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, oh, by the way, Mike and I will be having a reunion party on Sunday. 
can you also do me the favor of posting it on social media the same way you posted about my wedding night incidents? And you're specially invited. Go to hell! Oh, before I forget, there'll be lots of drinks and food, champagnes all over the place. I will make sure that I specially attend to you. You know, as my special guest of honor and my landlady. Get lost. <laughs> Came to see my uncle. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. okay. My that's uncle lives good. here. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Good to see you. You know. Ah. This is Mike's car. Yes, it is. We are back together. It's my best news of the year. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so happy. Thank you. Yes. This is my best news of the year. Thank you. Thank you. Thank After everything that happened, I became so sad, and you know, I, I can imagine the trauma you went through. My dear. I'm actually surprised that I survived it, oh. but <laughs> thank God I'm finally back to the love of my life. Oh. <laughs> so tell me, how did it happen? Hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a long story. Uh. Mike actually kidnapped me from the plaza and took me back to his house. <laughs> oh. Did you say kidnapped? Yeah, I mean kidnapped. It was just like a scene from an action movie. You needed to be there to see it. Oh, <laughs> it was so funny. Oh, I'm so happy for you. Thank I'm you. I'm really so happy much. for you. Thank you, Amaka. Amaka, that reminds me. Mike told me that you broke up with Kennedy. What happened? I I don't really know. In fact, it's it's partly because of what happened between you and Mike and I felt so sad and I became impatient with Ken. Everything just, just broke down. Can I ask for a favor? What? Get back to Ken. No, no, no. no. Please don't even go there. I have moved on. With another man? Uh, no, not really. Amaka. Kennedy still loves you. Mike told me that Kennedy loves you. Men always protect their friends against us. No. I'm telling you, he's still in love with you. Please, 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 please. Anyways, mm -hmm. we're having a get together on Sunday. Okay. Yes, like a reunion party. Uh huh. And you're invited. Because of you, I'll be there. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I know, but also Kennedy will be there. In fact, <laughs> you need to see him. He's going to be the master of ceremony. He's been planning the whole thing. Tina, Tina, I'm not coming again. If Kennedy's coming for the party, I won't be coming. Don't be like that. Please, please respect my, my decision, my opinion, please. Mm -hmm. Give me your number. I'll call you after the party. Okay, no, no. <laughs> go and Okay, go. okay. Um, Whatever did 
Mother, we need to do something. We cannot allow the devil to win this battle. We need to do something drastic. Remember, we battle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers in the high places. Mm. The Bible says that if we have faith, we can march on snakes and scorpions, and they shall by no means hurt us. Mm. Maduka, mm? you're not saying anything. I is it when this girl killed my brother that you will talk? Uh, no, uh, see, uh, Madam Carol, <clears throat> let me tell you my mind on this matter. Eh? If you truly love your brother, then let him live with the woman that he loves, the woman he is happy with. Simple. I have thought about this matter, and this, this, this is what I think. Eh? Think about it. Maduka, huh? what did I hear you say? So you want this wayward girl? to stay and kill my brother for each other. Caro, nobody is killing anybody. What did the girl even do, Seth? What did she even do? Eh? Look, you know I am the chairman of many organizations. So I hear a lot of stories, ugly stories about marriages and families. This uh, brother's mother is a simple case, a very small case, my, my case. Yeah. Small case? Yes, very small case. Marika, small case? Very small case. In fact, the girl is even a good girl to admit what she did in the past and even ask for forgiveness. <laughs> the real applicative runs girls. That's Ndogbonga, eh? They will never admit anything. If you like put knife there, if you like catch them red-handed, they will tell you it wasn't me. It wasn't me. Leave them alone. Please. Maduka. Huh? I thought we are in this battle together. Yeah. Carol, I am not fighting any battle with anybody. See, love is what makes the world go round. <laughs> After hey. everything, I have discovered that love is the real. Love is real. But you know, people like you who never experienced real love, especially in marriage, you will not understand it. But I do. Look at you. Maduka. Look at you. Look at who is talking about love. You think I don't know what is going on in your house? Do you think I don't know? And so? What, what, Do you think I don't know that most times you don't sleep at home? What is it that is going on in my house that is not also going on in my house? A lot! What is it? A lot! At least me, I, 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 I like and admire people who are in love. But you, you are angry and bitter. Angry and bitter. Why do you hate love, Caro? Why? Leave your, your, your brother's wife alone. Let them live their lives. Okay, the Caro? Let the girl enjoy her marriage. If you didn't enjoy your own, let other people enjoy their own. Can, can you do which thing here, Gabikun? Maduka. Again. I never knew you are double-edged sword. I am Judas not, is carrot. I am not in the world. You will pay for this. Story. I am telling you the home truth. Stop interfering in your brother's marriage. Let them live in peace so that you too will have peace. Stop interfering in their marital affairs. Do you understand? Hey. Caro, do you understand? I'm sure the girl gave you bribe. That is why you are talking out of point. What? But you see me, I'm a prayer warrior. I am not a bribe taking chairman. Wait, wait, oh. I am not a bribe taking chairman, you know. Oh, you are very bad. Go and manage your life. My Caro. God will judge you. Yeah. The heavens I serve yeah, will judge yeah. you. The girl will be happy with her husband, whether you like it or not. Maduka. Hey! King of Kings. You're just covering with church. You know your heart is not good. You're covering with. I am tired. I have tolerated King of your kings. enough. I have tolerated your, your hypocrisy enough. King of Kings. If you go to church, let your mind be there. El Shaddai. Don't say one thing and then you do another. Christianity is love, not hatred. 
Unfortunately, if I see you in our family, I will throw you with him. Your next I will be in heaven and see you in hellfire. I'll be in heaven. I'll see you in hellfire. Hypocrite. Human being. Oh, the devil is walking through Madoka. The devil is using a Madoka to penetrate my brother. Oh, 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 oh. This girl is going to Madoka, the kingdom of hell. Hey, mama, 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 the king of Goli, the Ayola Ashay Aholo. Hey, 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 hey. There is a reunion. What God has joined together, no man can tell. What is doing is written. What is doing is So I'll um, take this drink and put on the first table. And then this one as well. Put on the other table. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Uh, um, is everybody okay? Very, very, very good. Yes. Yes. Oh, thank you.
careful what you say. God is not a man.